Hey, I'm man. Start... Any Buffalo Wild Wings money, man? <laughs> Snake, I'm going to start messaging you now at random, just asking you for money. I will find no. your IP address. <laughs> <laughs> mailing you shit. I have ordered 500 <laughs> wings. Only God can stop me awesome. now. I'm going to send you Domino's <laughs> wings in particular. Oh, God, Domino's also, wings. <laughs> I bought a new 3D printer, and I, I was expecting the Chinese not to know what they're doing. So I bought an adapter oh. for the, as the uh, TF or whatever fuck card that they gave me. It's got a weird name to it. And I'm like, surely they didn't give me an adapter with the printer. The USB stick that I held in my hand is just a mere USB stick and not an adapter. It's an adapter. That's $20 uh-huh. gone. Bro, Jesus. You the Chinese make... do know what they're talking about. All around me are familiar either. faces. I was... Obey uh, the scale? What is Obey the scale? Heads up, chuckle fucks. Big boy Whoa. coming through. Obey the scale. has activated a mule potion. The autodidact oh, scale is in a plate carrier. For some reason, it looks like I don't have uh, permission to enable the, the broadcast video feed. Owners being holy oh, entities. I had that problem Duke last Bishop. time, too. Uh, uh, I fixed it. Yeah. I, I noticed Matt you got it back, it. so I was just like, I thought I'd ask. Allow, <laughs> I have that problem too. Allow user. There you go. There we go. Well, Sweet. Thank you. You are now oh, allowed. Have... I think you just have to reset permissions. Where's my camera pointed? Reset permissions. What does obey the scale mean? Right at your bear balls. Oh my god. Exactly. So oh god. I redid the furry scale out of spite. <laughs> Oh. I saw that. I-, I love how that one scale that I sent really pissed you off so much that you went the whole thing. E- immediately tilted. I was like, I was tilted on contact. No, I'm gonna redo this shit. You're all fucking wrong. I'll see you on hell. Is it why is this smash a bunny waifu? Okay, interesting. This is an interesting uh, chat that I don't venture yes, into. Yes, it off. is That's why it's a smash a bunny waifu. Uh, send me the scale. I want to see the scale that you're talking about. Uh. Uh, Aren't you? Uh, oh, 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 I know what you're in, talking about. Now. I, got, I got confused. I don't oh, feel like I, there's. Shit. You know how many slurs Steve. and bunnies I'm passing right now? There's a bunny in chain. Do you now? know how a many slurs and bunny I'm passing right now? <laughs> <laughs> Over a million slurs. <laughs> <laughs> That's a tiefling. That's not a monster girl. Yeah. So uh, the uh, so the slur harpy actually had them write the language in the actual Tonka language for one of them. So you have like. English and Tunka, Slur Harpy. Because we're all adults <laughs> here and definitely not giant man children. <laughs> Wait. Dude, girls with like jagged teeth are hot. They are. They so fucking are. Why I would are you guys attracted right to there. the British people? Kind of did. No, no, not no, no. I'm not attracted no. to the British. I no, want to no. fuck our women. We've okay? all gay fucking crooked teeth over here. <laughs> <laughs> like, like the one that the goddamn space wizard posted, like that oh. chick. That's like power with green space hair. Wizard. It looks like a mixture of, it looks like a mixture of power and um uh me the fucking VR idol, whatever her name is. Cody the said, animated. "What a lukewarm take, Sonic." <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I could give you more takes, but I'm not going to do it live on Twitch. Should be recorded for the internet. That's for Discord files. Now yeah, all of China so knows you're weird. Exposed. <laughs> no, I already let China have, have you attained address. proper hydration today, noble game master? Uh, yeah, my hydration's right here. Bed? A big old hydration. Coffee. Coffee. But yeah, so, so chat over here, we're, we're talking about this. We're talking about this right now, okay? Now look, the scale is by far the most accurate scale you ever find online, right? Number one, all women by baseline are monster girls because they're always fucking just they're monsters in their own right. They're all normal, bestial things. But no, like this, like this is correct. I don't care what you all think. This shit is correct. All right. I don't. I don't care how mad you may get, but I am correct and fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, my, my printer's making little squigglies. Give me a second. And and I hate how you guys said, "Hey, that that number five I was like, fuck off." Literally, like to to make a fur, you take this nose right here. You move it to the right to create the fucking muzzle and snout, and you just kind of connect it to the fucking mouth. Fur, I don't know how folks aren't just making bang drawn, because it's, it's the easiest shit ever. You draw a triangle, and you move it to the right or the left. <laughs> I'm not wrong. Bro, I got DMs. Hey, I didn't know you. <laughs> I, I posted that thing on, on X. People were like, hey, I didn't know you, I didn't know you did that. Was, hey, and I was like, get the fuck away from me. <laughs> I didn't know you were cool like that, damn. Where they uh, remixed the Ace Ventura 
audio where it's just like, I'm now a child of light. Your earthly money has no <laughs> Yeah. $20,000. Really? Really? Cody, I was talking about the one that pissed God off that Mims posted. He posted on our chat, though, so I see the two. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. I, I saw Cody in, in, in the main server oh, added me, and, and I'm like, no, not that one. I saw that one. I just want to see what Mims did. No, I didn't make this. This, this has been around oh. for fucking years now. Um, <laughs> oh. This has been around for see, years. See, this, is, this, is no, like, this one is, w is w w way too blocky. You got not furry and semi-furry like that. There are, there are levels to this. And why, that is a fucking animal. Like... <laughs> That is it's just okay, a God, fucking no, animal. Denial, my friend. I hate all of you so we, much. We know you're in denial, my friend. It's okay. No Walmart <laughs> is okay. safe for me now. <laughs> or Target. Total War Walmart. <laughs> Delicious. Me and Pippa, total Walmart death. <laughs> <laughs> Let me in on that. I fucking love that once you do a fucking Target. <laughs> I have a gun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw that one. I love it. <laughs> Now, if I say the full I, line, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get clipped out of fucking context, but it's, pre it's pretty fucking funny. You are, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, then there are more evidence. God, I he's know. gonna shoot up like he he said that. it online. He said he was one of the things. He's crazy. He fucking. I'm gonna blank a Walmart. The in fucking Minecraft. Yep. In Minecraft. <laughs> fucking already. The so, freaking neckbeard drama is so annoying. So, Franer, this hat is from, oh, yeah. uh, it's from, uh, Bacon Store, and I got clothes, fuck clips, oh, okay, that's why it's lagging, got clips to be open. So, this is, this is, a uh, you know, like, on, on, on a, uh, heat, heat ration pack for an MRE, it's got the rock or something? This is that. So, it's a bochi <laughs> rock or something. Oh, bochi, bochi so good. Because weebs infect Everything, including the gym and the army, it's everywhere. Wearing your socks. Get your ass, we do. And uh, oh, yeah. we, we are in your socks. We Weaves are definitely in your socks. And thanks to Coco, I got a new plate carrier. I, 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 I got the sale right on time, so I got a brand new plate cabby boy. With more spaces for patches. I know. All right. So you guys have successfully survived stuff. I believe the autodidact gave you guys items, correct? Or not items, spells? Uh, he's working on he, uh, something like that. We were talking about it um, uh, game, and he was saying that he was going to teleport away and mail us the books in return for the books being mailed back to him. Done. I guess. Library. <laughs> teleport away. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, well, that's my brain's word of the day. Teleport away? No, woohoo. Uh oh. Sashay away. See, I got started. And you did sketch the mule that I. Uh, yeah, I got. I got moon. the uh, plates right. of mass. HD kids really are autistic. Kids. Hey, bro, show me your mass. <laughs> Hell yeah, oh, brother. I still oh, cannot believe that two. giant black dude said that shit to me in the gym. Fucking re-injured my deltoid. <laughs> fucking just. Oh yeah, I, I I fucking love those. I love Hell Hitlers and fucking just completely retore my deltoid, dude. Uh. God, because because deltoid raises they're a little sus, you know, a little sus go up and down, you know, you because some of those grips you gotta do this with them, you gotta like palm it and do like yeah, it's it's a very sus workout if you're not watching yourself. Jack, would you up. say that uh that you, that you had to grip <laughs> it that you were gripping it? Huh? Huh? W would you say that you were gripping it? So I I know for a fact on at least three of them I was doing a thumb grip because my fucking fingies hurt. I was doing a little thumb catch grip because it's only like it's only like five pounds. Deltoids don't require a lot of poundage to work them out. So I do a little, little thumb grip, you know, a little 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 little, 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 little hail taxi move there. <laughs> Went a little too high. That's all I did. Chat. He missed. He missed that I made a, do a disrespect joke. <laughs> what? Doctor I made a doctor disrespect, disrespect joke that that he was uh, that he was gripping it for that for that person. Gr gripping Whoa. it. Gripping it. Boom. Alright. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm so... sorry. At this one, I think I'm speaking in moon rooms. I'm gonna stop. <laughs> I think you are. I think you are. I know what he's bro. saying. I think a whole fucking grip. language, bro. <laughs> like, you're just saying <laughs> words, dude. The f <laughs> Mims, are you uh, not making you references. You're just saying just, words. Uh, what are these terrific? Fucking do like NASCAR <laughs> rounds on my fucking head with those references. I'm like, what the fuck? What? Oh my god! What are these Ohio fucking terrific? Oh, yes. the fact that I heard a kid say <laughs> Ohio Riz live in action and target me when I fucking chokes him with a fucking tile. Not be Ohio Riz, man. 
Because then like I've heard someone say what the sigma before. Because is is like Ohio Riz bad or some shit or something like 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 yeah. Oh, Ohio's I don't bad anymore. I oh, Ohio is bad from your local Gen Z. Right? I am. Ohio is bad. Deeply affected. If it will translate. Ohio. Doogie, is bad. please translate this alien language. He said you're cringe. Fuck. <laughs> I am deeply offended. Okay, so Moonin is out for today. He's in a hotel room with one of other dudes doing stuff or something like that. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm sure he's fine. I'm sure he'll, he can he can bite enough. He's at a convention or something. Yeah, so he is currently in a hotel room with shitty Wi-Fi, and he has a task, a little list of tasks he wants to do. And unfortunately, I had a whole radio script written up for him. I guess I'll just fucking zip over that shit. <laughs> uh, but uh, That's okay. I can save it for later. Yeah. Bro, it's not hiring for a position for a Gen Z translator. I'm fucking tempted, dude. Jesus Christ. I, I or me? I'm already here. We're in the interview right now. <laughs> <laughs> You're like the Democrat Party running ads for uh, a Mr. Suki, what is it? Yeah. Manager. <laughs> I I did ask didn't know the fucking like like what's what's, what's get mean? I was like, is that like a fucking like car coming out or like a new phone? <laughs> I had no fucking idea, dude. I was like, oh, it's a butt. Oh, okay. They got the Giat five hundred guard. That, I that, I know guard get that level ten Giat. That, that, that fucking hot tour get yeah. Me. God, Jesus. Ew. Ew. everything God. is coming hot, down. Why are you hot? Just don't, hot don't talk on the Giat. Don't hug two of the gat. Oh, oh, no, uh, I was at the. Don't hug two of the gat. I was at the. I was at the end. The, the indoor range, and I got in a, you know, a lot of Gen Zers like Sue. So you're getting into the shooting guns, and uh, one guy said hug to lubricate that thing, and I was like, please fucking don't, dude. <laughs> Do not hug to on your fucking pistol. Because he had a little spray ball. He said hug to fucking lubricate that thing. I was like, I'm gonna, I, I will hit you in this, in this fucking indoor range. I'm gonna get a looter. the man Gen Z invade the gun spaces. Side. Bring your sling. <laughs> Bring a little See, sling. So it's not even Gen Z. Wait, is it? It's not even Gen guys? Z. It's Gen Alpha. Just yeah. hawk to on your Waffen guys. See, <laughs> See Rue, I understand where you're going from. Okay. However, I hope you. However, I hope you mean I, the fucking pistol state. <laughs> skibbity. Skibbity. skibbity? And Giat is all Gen Alpha stuff. However, as the generation above that, I'm able to translate to the millennials, which are behind me. You gotta have the in-between mm -hmm. generations mm -hmm. elaborate. Like a millennial explaining Gen X terms because their parents were Gen X. <laughs> yep. Right? So they're gonna understand those references, but they'll also understand Gen Z references because they have like a younger cousin or something because millennials can't afford to have kids i didn't i i i, I, I didn't make saying gin alpha fucking slang a war crime i swear to god you're a god fucking war crime get him out of here enough for you skibbity of you of you sergeant straight to jail off you go that's, that's my old brain rot ohio fortnite skibbity riz you know? does my lead core paramour no gen c and gen alpha slang fuck no she shit. does not i'm that's an immediate yeah, ruling i want to no. i want to see redhead marilyn monroe spouting gen z gen alpha slang that'd be so fucking funny boop boop be doop skibbity <laughs> Jeez. Somebody in the ocean that you just combined like the greatest generation and the, the Gen Alpha slang. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the worst generation. Not for your oh, I need to send a letter to my mother. Get a what? Guard, guard. I remembered now. I'm remembering in this moment. I'm gonna do it. That's the first thing I would do. I, I, I am lubricating my weapons. I'm maintenancing my weapons. The, say, the... say it correctly. Hooked my <laughs> firearms. <laughs> Say it right. Say it the right way. Uh, my firearms. Fuck to lubricate. So, uh, actually, I, I have a weapon cleaning kit in the van. In your, I got in, my, in your van. I got the alchemy lab in the van. The van with the fucking secret maintenance crew. Thanks, chat. Fair of the forest. <laughs> hey, I, I know that lady. She's a dangerous one. All the incels hate her because she's too based. <laughs> you could say that. Mm. You could say that Feral has that skibbity riz, I believe, Suki, correct? Is that how, is that correctly, Suki? Is that a correct application? Mm. Mm. It, it depends. It depends. <laughs> eh, eh, yeah. 
Depends. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Funny. What, what do you mean by that? Hey, yo, before I dip out, yeah. can you get me a roll just um for Cody's stealth mule? When will Rue receive his thing? Cody's what? Uh, He gave me the bride, and it's in exchange for something. Remember, Cody PayPal'd something over the weekend? Oh, good lord. Hold on. The... <laughs> the 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 out of game mules always fuck me up. I'm like, wait, y'all did what now? You ever did a thing? Oh, fuck me. <laughs> you can mule out of game. The things I could do to chalk dust. No, oh, you have no idea, dude. Uh, the things you could not really do to yourself. He sent me. Uh, I can't mule a potion into my own there game. All right. Uh, da -da -da -da. Trust me, Hama would have wonderled. Now, did you? Now, hold on. Now, did Rue give you the bride or? Yes, he did. Okay. The dice said me, so I'll take note of that and make sure it works in. Straight ten. Tell my wife I said yep. hello. <laughs> Real forces, <laughs> not not the skibbity Riz. I'm sorry, you're cursed like the rest of us. You'll all be skibbity in the end. My wife, my wife said, "What the fuck are you saying in your office?" <laughs> He's like, "What the fuck is he?" Kind of cringe, babe. Every my husband having a stroke. I need to call someone? <laughs> Husband Fu, are you okay? You spent too much skibbity money on. Husbando? <laughs> Husbando, you spent too many skibbity money on. Husbando. On, on... Classic. <laughs> you spent too much skibbity <laughs> money, now we have no house. Okay, so how many. So, so, My brain's starting to hurt. One, two, three, <laughs> four, five, six, seven, eight. No, hold on, I actually put these in fucking groups of five. Fuck it. Okay. There's like 50. Yeah, but I need an accurate number. I gotta roll for stuff. Because because remember, chicken wings. remember each guy has a fucking rifle and fucking gear and money <laughs> yeah, and shit. I forgot about so you're gonna that. have like literally like a, a, a fucking like fucking war crime stack of rifles, just like you know you know the scene from like Lord of War, the stack of M16s they're trying to sell by weight. Well, I can yeah. save you a little bit of time. A good portion of those corpses were likely charred by Sugi. Well, uh, when he was cleaning it, out the fire. It, 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 so, 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 so what I'm gonna roll is see how much of the gear survived out of. Okay. The dudes who died. Yeah, I right. just thought I'd try to do three, three four, five, six, six, twelve, <laughs> twelve, like eighteen, nineteen, twenty, 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 while there is a stream thread channel on the Discord, I don't look into it because I don't want to like I don't want to peek in. It seems kind of rude to me to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, four, thirty, six, nineteen. Nineteen. There is exactly fifty bodies. Well, way to go, me and guys, I guess. Um. So if a D a D well, we'll do a D fifty because I can do this on this device of digitality. Twelve. Well, that's not great. <laughs> oh. Wait, is that how many? Okay, so that's how many got burned. So that's great for us, right? Right? I think he said that's how much. That's how many survived. He says he's right. 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 Guard. Right. right. <laughs> okay. So you guys find twelve usable uh, M16s. You find forty-six charges. Of rifle ammunition, so any kind of rifle will fit into. Uh, additionally, you find twelve guilders. Jeez, these guys are broke. <laughs> <laughs> these guys are broke. Barely gets you shot. Forty shank pieces, and the. These guys are broke. <laughs> <laughs> you broke ass motherfuckers. Shit. I know. Fucking orcs. Of course they're broke. You know they're black coated, right? I'm just kidding. I think, yeah. Please show your picture, Hommel, so I don't get yelled at. <laughs> <laughs> Hommel is black. All right, chat. Don't don't black. fuck it. If you're new chat, here, don't. Chat. Hommel is black. <laughs> I am black. I, 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 I'm, black. I, I'm a black man. I'm a black American. Uh, I've said it, but it looked like a uh, too, so I, my I fellow black Americans. Uh, fucking my fellow black Americans. Uh, that was a joke. That was that was a joke, people. I can say these jokes. 
Please, God, no, please, no. And it's an even bigger joke that orcs are supposed to be black. Like that actually pisses me off. They're people think no, that. no, no. They're actually they're actually Latino now. Don't you know? Oh my yeah, God! Yeah, Erm, er, actually. Why can't they just be orcs? Why can't they just be orcs? Why, why do they because need to be No, no. has to be political. Everything, Everything is coded. Racial. Why? Why can't yeah. they just be orcs? I'm going to I'm going to make my orcs as not coded as possible when I when I write publicly. Well, makes a good well, point. What about all the orphaned coded. bees? So That's here, true. What about so bees? I was going to get there. I was going to get there. Um, I'm going to do a B roll. Okay, it's going to get kind of complicated. And you guys, you guys might be in danger when I do this. All right, because all the bees are going to behave <laughs> differently. So we're going to see how many bees from the fifty. Because remember, each orc has one bee on them, right? So, you just roll a shit ton of African honeybees. <laughs> <laughs> Mother of God! <laughs> it appears there are 40 swarms of Africanized orc and honeybees. Mother of God! Okay, so there are 50 orcs, right? So how many bees, rather not mulched or burned alive by 50 cal and fire? 40 bees, okay. <laughs> pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. Uh... Get up, get up my chart real quick. I got so many PDFs open. Holy fuck. I, th I think uh, Forge heard my heard my statement because it kicked me from the game. Oh, no. <laughs> it, cr it crashed and made me log back in. Forge said black player. Ping. <laughs> <laughs> could, could, you, could you fucking imagine? <laughs> okay, how many type rolls? <laughs> fucking imagine. How many type rolls are we getting here? Because a lot of the bees will share the same clan. Three types of bees. All right. So the first type of bee, one, two, three, is going to be. Oops. An eight. Okay. Purple and red. There's so many African honey bees, please. Well, purple and red's okay. They're they're okay. God, God have mercy on us, the African honey bees. Uh, some six. of my elves, arrow. Some of my elves. Okay, there are swarm bees here. That, that's an issue. Okay. Uh, <laughs> so so you guys did roll lavender and teal. Lavender and teal are the caustic swarming bees. That may be an issue here in a minute. Um, so as you guys are looting and gathering up the equipment from the bodies, uh, black and purple. Okay. So I want you guys to spread out your tokens to an area where you want to loot stuff. All right. You, uh, so go ahead, and, go ahead, and go ahead and take take your tokens, <laughs> move them to it, do an area with dead people in it. There's a minefield of honeybees out there, but go ahead and go ahead and. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm loading. I'm assuming these are probably the least damaged because I didn't yeah. drive past the, here with the fireball. The further away from the center they'll be, the less charred and crispy they're gonna be. Yeah. Now There's we're... also conveniently exactly thir thirteen right here. <clears throat> okay. How much pistol ammunition do they have on them? Uh, there are no pistols here. It's just rifles. These are just uh, ir irregulars. It's uh, wait. Is it not common in the military to have a sidearm? Uh, depends on what you are in the military. MPs carry sidearms. A lot of well, it depends on also what military you're in. Uh, well, yeah. You usually there usually there is a sidearm. These are orcs being paid by the Fey, so they're gonna splurge on sidearms for the orcs. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, because elves are racist. <laughs> Yeah, damn. There's a joke there. I'm not gonna say. <laughs> I wanted to. <laughs> I, I heard the rain go skirt. Okay, so Rue, you moved yourself. Hommel, move yourself. Uh, I'm with. Oh, oh, Sugi. I thought Sugi moved. Um, I, if Sugi's dragon driving the. Uh, oh, there's two Hommels. Dragon wagon. Not... Oh yeah, yeah. I actually added one when I was re making Hommel evolve. You motherfucker. Wait, let me actually Ooh. delete this Hommel and, and actually put Hommel evolved on the screen. Hold on, hold on. I'll I'll. Now drag yourself in. Evolved. All right. Oh, that's oh, what? <laughs> yeah, that's the name of the 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 region. You 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 redid your entire character sheet. Yeah, you told me to. You're such Not a all of it, but I redid my. You're stats. such a fucking muttonhead, dude. It's, just change your run you had already. No, <laughs> no I wanted to do it right this time. I, I don't know what I screwed up the first time, and I I, have a better I will delete Hamul the lesser than delete. 
No. Okay. Bye, Homo. Hopefully you got everything transferred. I really don't know if I did, but it's okay. We're going to find out. <laughs> uh, I copied the sheet. I just deleted the stats. So you're over there. All right. So this group right here. These... I am here to show the Veil Riders Arma OP. Oh yeah, so Holy so so chat Ella uh, ELA has made an Arma thing for Veil Riders, which is something I guess. Ooh, yeah, that's cool. an Arma mod. Weaponized autism on the move. <laughs> Cheeky chooky. Okay, uh, let's see here. So let's we'll see what kind of bees that that Sugi and Hummel find. Okay. Oh, no. On a four, you re-roll. Okay, re-rolling. Two. Africanized honeybees. Yeah, yeah, that, that's less lavender and teal, yeah. So, so you guys start picking those bodies apart, and the bees have all come together in a little, in a little mini swarm. Um, we're going to see how many bees attack out of this little bitty swarm here. It's, I'm just going by the rules of the book. Only 17 bees. Oh, good. Okay, that's, that's not great. Uh, <laughs> I got this. I, I hope I do this right. This I really don't want another repeat. Okay. So I this the thing is, I would need a a save from Hamlin Sugi and Cunning to not be ambushed by these bees because it's dark outside, and they're kind of lying in wait. <laughs> uh, the lavender and teal uh, bees great. are kind of fucking assholes. Straight up Cunning. Straight up Cunning. Cunning even. <laughs> you, you know Sugi. I, I have a bit. You know Sugi. Sugi, there is, um, the, I learned about these bees on the other side of the veil. Heads up, they call them, fox, big boy like, freaking, freaking honeybees or something? They're, like, very aggressive bees. I, I don't, it was, I, I look out, I don't know if we have them on the side of the veil, but, like, just look out. So, uh, well, we're on the other side of the veil. Well, I don't know what these orcs have gotten into. Can you imagine? I don't know if the orc bees have bred with the uh, other side of the veil bees. Maybe the fair are doing weird experiments. The they bee... don't have any sidearm ammo. The... This is annoying. And then the bee just <clears throat> right on fucking Hummel's face. Just <clears throat> stinging you. Uh, now, due to the apparent smoke, Cody, the number of bees is halved. So, due oh, to the... Yeah, there would be a lot of smoke, wouldn't there? Yeah, so due to the Hummel being so fucking loud, the bees are now swarming Hummel. Uh... There are now eight bees swarming Hamotsugi, and after this first round of... Now, remember, a, a orc bee can sting a lot. It's not just one sting. They can tick, 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 and drill into you. So you're going to take 8d4 caustic damage, Sugi. Now, or sorry, uh, Hamot. Now, now, Sugi, when you see Hamot screeching in pain as these bees are fucking laying waste to him, apparently... Oh, fuck me. Laying waste Jesus to Hamel. Uh, these are very large bees. They are very angry. They're very hostile. And they are stinging the absolute dog shit out of Hamel. So, Sugi, what do you do to help him out? Sugi, these are the African honey bees! Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> I don't know, it's just these big old bird sized bees just on, like, on his face and his, his mouth and his ears. This is my worst nightmare! Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. This is actual Hommel. Not the bees! Ah! Okay. I'm just going to say, Hommel, stop, drop, and roll, and I'm going to... Um... Stop, drop, and roll. <laughs> Rack's machine gun. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Run to the smoke. Uh, no, I'm going to uh, bite my thumb and prepare to cast uh, Kiss of Allure, because i got to do like the like, flick it. <laughs> and so I'm going to have... Health action to blast the air above Hommel the moment he drops. They're gonna they're gonna fall off. Of so here's a problem oh with these bees, right? Um, Lever and Teal, as they say, are assholes. So even as Hommel is rolling on the ground, I'm gonna roll D8 to see how many get crushed. It's eight. <laughs> ah! Oh wow! This, this game is bullshit. So you Heads you prepare? Yeah. Big boy coming through. Hold on. Tom has activated a mule potion. Yeah, that's Tom. Tom, Tom, is, Tom is Tom is seeding. So, so Tom is seeding a, a, a big bad. Enemy encounter against Chuck. Counter build oh. as you will guard. You already, you already fucked up my condola, Tom. What? So, <laughs> so Hamel, as you're rolling on the ground, Suki, you're preparing your your kiss of her lure. But thankfully, Hamel, your big bulky fucking Goliath body crushes the bees to death. 
and you only take this one round of stinging. Mind you, you're covered in a lot of bee juice now, but you have survived the encounter, this little little trap of yours. Now, Rue, you go ahead and roll me a, 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 a d4. Okie dokie. Almost cry. Flash underscore. <laughs> roll for anaphylaxis. <laughs> Five dollars. Roll for oh, no. Hold on. Is Sugi allergic to bees? Oh. oh no, you're fine. Oh. Didn't I get like Pommel. a twenty six yeah, though? Yeah, but you're talking. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> These well, African honeybees. There's yeah. one of them. So Hummel does so Hummel is not allergic to bees. That's good news, because if not you'd be fucking dead probably. Alright. Rice may come through so large. Guys. <laughs> so Rue, you find <clears throat> number three, black and purple. Black and purple. Black and purple, black and purple. Ah. Wait, what? Yeah, yeah. So you find um how many? These are very important little bees. You find three black and purple bees. Now, um I was gonna say out of, out of character here. Uh these bees are extremely intelligent. These bees have expert intelligence. Uh, because of the fact that these bees are the messenger bees. These bees can transcribe a message, dip their feet in ink, and then write that message out on paper. So you need to quickly think of a way to entice these bees to not either sting you or fly away. They're not outwardly aggressive. Uh, They're very smart. Can I have just a second to look at my items very quickly? No. No, it's good. Uh, so, no. Okay. No, no, you're fine. You're fine. Go <laughs> ahead. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> well, you know, I gotta ask these things. Um, Son of a bitch! <laughs> I really don't have any... Is there, like, a particular diet for these types of bees? Would I know that? Flowers? I mean, Sugar? there are certain types of bees that build nests out of meat, so if... These are if these are not they are the bees. type that would build these, a nest out of meat. These are regular fucking okay. bees, my guy. They they like honey and like fucking flower pollen and shit and I don't know Gatorade. I don't give a fucking know. If they are expert in or uh, high intelligence, would they be able to understand speech? Yeah, so they can transcribe their message. Yeah. All right. Um. You know, I'm going to be going to a rather sunny place here soon. Uh, maybe some flowers will be there. If you want to follow along, you can have your fill. You know, I'm <laughs> going to a big flower battle here soon. Do you guys feel like coming? Uh, <laughs> yeah. You have no persuasion. I mean, he's not going to force them to stick around. They're not technically his. <laughs> now, you, you know, do you want to try and persuade them or simply bluff them? Because your bluff will add um, plus one, but your bluff will come out differently if you fail. So, yeah. Persuade would be more topical here, I think. It, it, it'd have more of a place. It's just a flat D20. Uh, I play nice, and I still fail. But you, <laughs> but, but you still add your moxie to it, because it's a moxie check. Persuasion, bluffing, oh. it's all moxie. Oh. So it'd be okay, 15. Okay, so that's a plus 10 for total 15. Yeah. These little bees... So... Ah, fuck it. Let's, let's do it. Let's do a roll. It'd be a bit of a Okay, so one bee. So the rest kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of float away. But one bee, one black and purple bee, kind of goes, eh, kind of gives you a look, kind of cover hovering in the air there, and it kind of, kind of flies it right in front of your face. And these things are huge. These things are about the size of like uh, like like a fucking bird sized bee, <laughs> and it's kind of, like, and you can see that it's it's it's, kind of, it's actually looking you over, and. It kind of flies around you in a little 360. And then it kind of kind of lands on your shoulder, right right along your deltoid. You plan on coming with me, though, bud? All right. Well, I won't force you to stay or go. So do as you wish. <laughs> <laughs> bee noises, Kumiko. That leaves you <laughs> with one kind of bee. Uh, oh. you find a few of the purple and red. Now, these ones are basic intelligence. They're a basic gas bee. They're like, LOL, flower, go burr. You find <laughs> four of these bees, but at the exact same time, they're not nearly as intelligent 
as the other bees that Rue found, and they kind of go, and they kind of look at you, kind of, kind of, all four are like pointing at you, and they're kind of ridding their stingers. Uh, what do you do? <laughs> do I happen to have um, like it's like general cooking ingredient of just like sugar water, like simple syrup, like on you? Yeah, like on me. Did you prepare simple syrup? Mayhaps. <laughs> you see, may <laughs> perchance. Maybe? It's not a it, perchance. It's not karate. Yes, karate. Maybe it's karate. <laughs> <laughs> perhaps i did did you maybe i did did you who knows <laughs> you should know <laughs> you know what romy romy a d20 fuck it okay if i recall correctly that orc that homo was playing around with promised to give us all those bees if we killed him <laughs> it's called an obvious lie by the way <laughs> yeah, yeah, That's them. That. so almost saw that you have Simple syrup, sure, yes. In the crash dragon wagon, you uh, which I am right next to. Yes. <laughs> Give me a. You have no supply, okay. I have seer. <laughs> this count is escaping. That fails, I have survive, devotion. survive the bees, evade the bees, <laughs> escape the bees. Um, exactly. Resist the bees. Just give me a cunning check. Okay. So you find the broken bottle of your prepared simple syrup you happen to have, and there's barely there's barely a palm sized amount left in this little broken bottle. Okay, um, just gonna pour that on. Let's say I don't know how bees eat. I'm gonna pour that on a little, like just in my hands. I'll hold it out to the bees. Please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. <laughs> <laughs> Please, God, don't. Uh, roll me Moxie. Okay. Since you lack persuasion. Yeah. Well, <laughs> there are four bees. How many? How many? How many sting you? Okay. Uh -huh. You are stung. Three times by bees. Ah, fuck! And you kind of like, they kind of like, kind of like look at each other, and one bee's like, eh. Other three are like, let's get her. And they all kind of like turn around and sink their stingers into your into your palm. Um, you will oh, take no. basically three d two damage. Slash R three d two X. As they're making a oh my God. toilet movie. <laughs> Wait, G2s yeah, are yeah, crazy. Are. G2s are insane. God, why? Oh, oh, she's, she's already dead. This. She's already dead. <laughs> <laughs> she's already dead. <laughs> minus 19. <laughs> so fuck. it stings you yeah, right in a place where reflexology says the bad place you'd be stung in. Uh, and I guess roll me a grit save. So we'll, see, we'll see if you're fucking... <laughs> See if you're fucking. He's Kumoko allergic. I'm allergic to bees. To bees. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, okay well. you're not allergic to bees. You're just kind of caught off guard by the stings. And the bees. Now they sting you, and the one bee kind of goes and kind of gets off your hand. What do you do with these three bees? Oh, great heavens! <laughs> <laughs> I honestly think her reaction would be. Drop the bottle or use the bottle as like a makeshift shank. Just start stabbing the bees that attacked her. <laughs> or use her fry or drop the bottle and pick up her frying pan or something. Cause I don't know, they attacked me first. Yeah, Kumiko, your frying pan. Um about that. What happened? It's in the grassland somewhere. <laughs> It is. Your your frying pan. You roll a natural one on on, on a hit and kind of squeak it out of your hands. And you threw yeah. it like into the grassland somewhere. Oh, it's a good thing I have this broken bottle as a makeshift shank. So you're gonna try and <laughs> shank the bees? Yeah. So you <laughs> ah, shank ah, the bees. Ah, try, ah, and, try and shank <laughs> these bees. The bees are like, yeah, what? What's going on? They're they're trying to fight back. Those who would be looking on, if they could, we would see we have a spider trying to stab bees with a shank. Um, mm -hmm. It does not work as well as it could have worked. 
but you do fend off these three orcish honeybees. And there's one bee kind of kind of hanging in the air in front of you. This is the one friendly bee. I'm just gonna show it where the rest of the is uh, like drag my my unstung hand. Your, your bright red hand. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> three giant welts, motherfucker. <laughs> I feel like, like the spider bites from the first Spider-Man movie. Yeah, yeah, it's, like, yeah. it's fine. I don't have health insurance. Guess I'll die. <laughs> <laughs> just gonna show it where the uh, honey or the simple syrup has been dropped, and just be like, "There, have at it." I'm just gonna. You have that. Here, have at it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> scoot away. So. <laughs> Okay, uh, I'm gonna roll a check for the bee if he sticks around. <laughs> no, the okay, so this bee's just gonna <laughs> fly away. So, mm -hmm. Hummel got jacked up by bees, Kubiko got jacked up by bees. O only Rue's like, I got a new friend, <laughs> <laughs> so, no buddy, and it doesn't want to suck my wolf cock <laughs> <laughs> for now. Uh, so purple and red. Whoa. So, so, yeah, so, so in case you're wondering, purple and red bees, uh, they create a type of spiced honey that can warm the body and counteract cold and freezing damage. So, in case you were wondering, Nick Cage, Nick Cage bee scene? Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it's backward. Okay. So, uh, you guys find t uh, f 12 M16s, 46 charges or magazines, of uh rifle ammo 12 guilders 40 shanks 126 clip pieces and one b not counting other gear like clothes and boots like how thoroughly do you want to loot these orcs and dead southern elves i want their uh dog tags of course how many of those dog tags would have survived the fire all of them dog tags are just pure metal Rue that makes after... 66 dog tags. <laughs> In the back after this of the bee decides to hang out with Rue, Rue would want to like kind of look around and see if any of them maybe have like uh, uh, an owner's manual or something like, or like a care manual or something. For the bees, if maybe one of them. Yeah, like how how the fuck do I take care of this thing? <laughs> The bees are taught via childhood how to take care of bees. There's no manual. Like, oh, look, it's orc die with a fully functional manual. How? No, there's none of that shit going on. Maybe one of them took notes or something. No, they didn't take notes. It's a fucking, <laughs> they innately know. They're trained to take, no, there's no notes. <laughs> oh, well, it was worth a shot. Jesus Christ. <laughs> is you like... see Rude just run, running his pockets like for the... surely he has like a booklet or a, or a little is, manual is, is there a pamphlet no, on not. bee care and you guys find the pamphlet you and yeah. your bees step one don't get stung <laughs> fucking welts on Hummel's <laughs> face <laughs> well after that Rue would take a little bit of time to make sure that everybody's healed up from their bee wound <laughs> I got I gotta find my freaking frying pan. Yeah, 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 yeah. You gotta find your frying pan, and Rue will help you now that he doesn't have his his uh, movement. Uh, now, yeah. do, does either Rue? Does anyone here have supply? I did. You did. Uh, supply. I did. Let me see. <laughs> I did. I have plus two supply. Okay, so Rue, roll me supply and. Oh, what is supply? I've used supply in so long for a fucking roll. One second here. <laughs> Let's go to page 70. Shit. Went too far. Fuck. Okay, here we go. Supply. Supply. Oh, it's Moxie. Yeah. <laughs> roll Moxie. <laughs> okay. That's plus 12 to the roll. You needed that. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Could I? It, would it maybe have like a distinctive smell to it from having been used as much as it has? Uh, yeah, maybe of, of you're iron a dog. Slightly yeah. because of the blood. That'll reduce the DR, I guess. So yeah, so you find a frying pan after about an hour of searching through the grass, fucking bloodhounding your way through the fucking tall grass. 
<laughs> um, Eventually, I just smell the distinctive smell of that one full foot cultist's brains. Ah, <laughs> yes, queen's beans, my favorite. Okay. <laughs> queen's beans. <laughs> queen's beans. Oh, oh my. <laughs> Oh my queen beans are barking! My goodness, <laughs> he's yelling like like an old like an old hound dog because he's just eating queen's beans. <laughs> Some <laughs> dead guy's brains. It just fucking bees like what the fuck? <laughs> uh, so so no, but wait, wait, you find the pan. Now again, how deeply do you guys want to loot these people? Because because I gotta track all this shit. Like I have thirteen pairs of boots or some bullshit. Um, I'm personally just grabbing dog tags as I'm searching them, and then I'm going to uh, drag them and just like into like a little like a little pile. I want to search ch- for survival supplies and stuff like food and bandages. You find two IFAX. That's it. Getting up onto the dragon wagon, like up on top of it, right. and looking through his scope. Oh, sorry, go ahead. You're fine. Um, l- looking through a scope, would I be able to see maybe any kind of uh, encampment these guys might have had? No. Because right now, he doesn't expect any of them to have any medical supplies on them, but he would check, um, even if they didn't. No, I did if... ask. There, 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 there's no camp in sight. There's no camp in sight? Mm-mm. Okay. Well, if they don't have any medical supplies, then uh, that's all we would be looking for. Almo is going to look for a few things. Number one, he's going to chuck the southern elves for pistol ammo. De- uh, desperate for you, hounding for pistol ammo. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Fucking dumbass. God damn it. <laughs> Just go, on, just go through pockets. <laughs> Man, that dream kind of fucked you up, huh? I have purpose. <laughs> yeah. It's just how he talks. It's now. the brain damage. The face. It's just the brain yeah. damage. It's, a, <laughs> it's just the brain damage from having something ripped out of my soul. Hamel, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's a furry now, I guess. All right. <laughs> I'm a wolf. <laughs> okay, Hamel. <laughs> Okay, buddy. <laughs> okay, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> you ask which scale is Hummel using on the free scale? Exactly. Hummel's <laughs> a hard five, probably. Like <laughs> uh, <laughs> on both scales. <laughs> yeah, four is like Scooby Doo. Five is like. All right. So you're trying to find pistol ammo. Go ahead and give me brain power bucket. Okay, at the same time, I'm also looking for any valuable artifacts like necklaces or like other stuff that might be of value to these southern elves and orcs, like trinkets and uh, letters to wives and other stuff. Post artifacts, that's the word. You find two magazines. Well, I shall say it like this you find 14 charges of pistol ammo. All right, 14 charges. I'm just going to put them. I don't know where to put that. I don't know, on the main tab and the notes and equipment thing, be a good place to start. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, yeah, those, those do exist. You can go there and click a little <laughs> little pencil and type in things and save it. It's fucking crazy. I forgot. I kind of forgot about that. So 12 charges. Can't give players anything, bro. Fuck. Would any of the uncharred bodies have, like, intel or anything on them? Marching orders? Maps? I will see if someone broke protocol here no so these oh. orcs and elves have properly exercised uh opsec due to runs with other special op teams in the field they were thwarted by certain aspects of their sneaky doing so these guys had verbal orders and nothing else okay oh well that was worth a shot uh so sugi you are piling up bodies uh kumiko you were trying to find. <laughs> there's just, there's there's just a, a corpse few... pile in the middle of this burned out field. <laughs> there was a few more things. What? What do you want? Oh, personal personal artifacts, like valuable personal artifacts, like tr- like lockets, rings that give like give me magic. Or, um, what else was there? Was one other thing that I realized? Um, you said like letters to widows. Letters to Hubble, widows. Hubble's gonna riz the widows. What the fuck? 
<laughs> so I heard you're single. I'm gonna steal your wife. What? I killed your husband. Now I'm gonna fuck your wife. <laughs> I'm gonna I, share uh, my new favorite saying that I got off of a Twitter post I found on Pinterest. Sure, go for it. It's a uh, life is all about rock paper scissors. I rock the fuck out. I get that paper and I scissor your wife. Nice. The most aggressive lesbian yeah. on the fucking world. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Also look for knives. <laughs> Knives, well, yeah, this place is, is a bit, all the orcs have a goddamn knife, but it's like just a simple dagger, nothing really fancy. Okay, good for throwing, you think? Oh, I mean, collect the daggers, stab them in succession. I'll say, tw I'll <laughs> say 10, I'll say 10 knives, 10 daggers. Well, saying there, there basically be 50 daggers in this fucking field. Uh, you know, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll, I'll, I'll do this. I'll I say. This. There are three exceptionally unburnt daggers you can choose from. Oh, okay, so three, three. So I just get three daggers instead of, I was going to say 12. <laughs> how about I get 12 daggers? How, much, how, how, about, how about I say what you fucking get? That's the sound there, Hummel. Yeah, okay, okay. Well, you said there's 50 daggers, so I was like, he I'll says, just take 12. He said, how about I get 12? How about you just wait for me to roll a dice? <laughs> I got you. Well, you said there's 50 daggers, so I said I get 12 daggers. 50 dagger blades. You said 10. Yeah, there's blades. There's 50 dagger blades. Because there's a fucking sun being just... dragged around the fucking field. Oh, yeah. I'll take three daggers. Where does pile of slag come from? Wow. <laughs> Ooh, wait. Actually, technically, we could collect the slag of those daggers and get... I'm, I'm not going to do that to you. Could you fucking imagine how mad I'd be if you did that shit? <laughs> Can I collect the slag? Uh, Hummel, roll... Actually, no, Sugi. Sugi, Sugi, you're piling up bodies. Sugi, roll me a D8. Come on, so you roll it. What do you find, Sugi? Seven. That's a fun one. <laughs> uh -oh. Five, six. Right to the strife. Let's go. So, Hommel, you're watching Sugi drag bodies around, and you see one with an odd-looking pocket. Go ahead and roll me a D12. Or, sorry, D17. So, slash R1 D17. Sixteen. Oh shit. Uh oh. Pommel, you see a pocket with a big ass bulge in it. What do you do? Where is is the pocket towards the front? Is the pocket Hommel just walks over to it. Sugi, hang on a second. To, to, to take a to, to hold up for a second. There's a uh, is the bulge a front pocket or a side pocket? Front pocket. <laughs> What's the valuable sense valuable skill guard? I, I love a particular. I'm gonna shut the fuck up. <laughs> the fucking rub hand and together fucking skill. Hmm. Yes, sense valuable. <laughs> the, the, the merchant, the merchant skill. Yes. Uh, there is I no such skill to... in the game. I'm afraid. <laughs> so I'm going to pull my knife out. I'm gonna like do a little knife flip, and I'm going to like. Sugi, I'm gonna like do it, like cut around like the the edge of the bulge. <laughs> if I feel flesh, I'm stopping. Sugi's just standing the there. I I cut around the bulge. <laughs> Sugi's just dragging this dude by his feet and just like giving you a what the fuck look as you're carving into his shirt. Pants. She's just stopped him. Pants. Even worse, yeah. Pants. I know what this looks like, Sugi, but I have a feeling here. Are you gonna pull a Rue again? Is there some sort of cocky demon that's my party members? No, no, that part uh, of my brain's gone now, and I have better purpose, so I keep cutting. I rolled a cut around his bulge. Uh, so as you cut, for some reason, um, you cut a big enough slot where I want to show you what it looks like. I'll, I'll, show it, I'll show it to only Sugi and only Hommel what this is. Yeah, over Discord. Yeah, I'll do Discord. What a shame! I thought Guard was gonna show us. Guard's like, which screen do I have to look at? He like sends us a dick pic. I thought Guard was gonna show us the bulge in his pants. He sends us like a dick pic. He just wait a minute. That's a goddamn penis. That's an orc penis. Garbro strikes again. All you get is cut. Oh. This is what He's... you see. 
this is mighty interesting, and Hummel's gonna reach for it and take it. Ah, 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 ah. No, no, spiders keep no, us. No, 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 no. no, no. Sugi, no, 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 no. <laughs> what? 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 What is? What is for a second? Someone's now? read the manual. Okay. <laughs> Hummel, two yes. steps back. First right. off, why? Second. Two steps back. All right, what do you want? I'm going to ask her what this thing is. Because her, her, her. That, that that material, I don't think, is from our world. Right. It's that, obviously. That, uh, that, that, what, what is it called? Plastic. My shoulder? Plastic, oh. because plastic explosive, yeah. you know. I, I know. Yeah, I've learned so this from my world. I'm oh, you're, ask her. you're asking your paramour what it is. Yeah, I'm like, hey, what is that? <laughs> Is she do is she do production bullet? That's what I wonder. Hold on, is she, would she know? She does. She goes, oh, that's um, that's a music playing device. What does she oh. say? Yeah, you know, um, you uh, you put a little little brick inside of that little flappy bit in front. They're kind of old. Um, you know, we we kind of use phones nowadays, but you know, yeah, you uh, put a little brick inside of it. Press a button and it'll play music through the little uh, heady things. Oh, uh, how do you put the heady things? I think you just like put them over your ears. Like he's kind of like okay. bloop, put them over your ears. All right, Hollow, come here real quick, and then I'm gonna pick it up. It's wait, 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 wait. What? What are we doing? It's a surprise. No, 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 no. You said no. You said I can't touch this, and now you don't want touching it. So okay. what do you have in mind? Hommel, I know how to use it. I'm going to teach you how to use it because I feel like explaining with words wouldn't convey it properly to you. Do I trust him? <laughs> All right, Suki. <laughs> I do. I remember Hommel. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna place the the headphones over his ears. Over your ears. O over over Hommel's ears. Over Hommel's ears. This is so fucked up. Um. <laughs> this is gonna be good uh okay um <laughs> so you put over his ears all right and he looks kind of stupid because you know it's a pair of fucking ancient headphones mm -hmm. and there he's big and he's big and your uh paramore goes yeah it's the um triangular button nick should make it i see a brick inside of it and i assume you just press the button and it should play okay i'm gonna press play press play <laughs> so i'm still recovering for the beef <laughs> <the beef>. uh <laughs> Uh, this Suki, is... you know, I trust you, right? Well, Hommel like, did I, one I purpose. Like now he's got a double purpose, I guess. Oh, um, no. So you, the, the music plays, and you don't know what the music is. You don't know the words, but it's, it's a very peppy, upbeat song. From... Is it promiscuous girl? Am I the surf? <laughs> what? You know that meme of surfless is a promiscuous girl? No, I do not. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> so you're hearing these 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 upbeat '80s beats in in your in your head, and and as you hear the these beats, kind of you feel yourself. You get you feel yourself being beckoned. Oh, this is literally that beep gone. <laughs> um, and you're kind of like, mm, mm, and your head slowly turns. And you're looking dead southeast. Right. This, this I, I, I kind of like this music, Sugi. It, it's, it's got a pretty good beat to it. Now, I think now, they're wanting me to go to Funky Town. Now, now, Hommel, if anyone tries to remove those headphones from your ears... You will be engaged and forced to fight them and keep them from pulling them off your ears. Oh no. You are wearing the walking man's walkman. Oh no. Okay. So at this point, Suki, not aware of this at all, 
is trying to share some music with his bro and is going to try to take them off of his head so he can get a listen because he just said it was some good beats. So, so, (laughs) (laughs) so, 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 uh, so you see Hamel. You know that scene where he tries to take the ring at Guard Grossfield desk. How the hell did that Walkman get away from Castle and Boyard? Great question, Madcap. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> uh, Sees you, Madcap. He's just ignoring you. <laughs> Go on. Yeah, but uh, but more. Yeah. So you know that scene from Lord of the Rings where Frodo tries to take the ring from Bilbo. It's literally that with Sugi. Like, like retracts away yeah. from Sugi when, 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 when you reach for the headphones. What the fuck. This music is is amazing. It's really good. I, don't take these from me. I'm gonna. I'm gonna press the play button again. Hope it gets stops it. You go to reach for the. I never handed oh, it to me. You're holding it. I'm holding it. I just put the headphones on his head. I've been holding it. Hamel, you uh. see his finger drift towards the big red circle. You feel compelled to attack Sugi now. I rolled CQB. So, so Sugi Hummel is Hummel is Hummel is. Well, like, how do you attack him, uh, Hummel? Like, trying to punch him? Just or what? like, like try and smack him. Like, like try and smack his hand away. So, so, so Sugi, um, what, what's your your base? Your DR fifteen. Well, what's your base DR? As a waste thirteen. So you can you 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 hear Hummel kind of go no and kind of lash out at you as you kind of jerk your shoulder away you, you feel your finger kind of come away from the from the red button and Hamel is now again kind of hackles rays kind of coming at you now um uh, Luke, get us away from me bro i'm what the f- 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 so this music what? is really good what? don't inf- don't break my vibe i hate it when people interrupt the song you got to restart it from the beginning don't break my vibe <laughs> What the f- can I just like this quickly? Is- can I just like unplug the headphones? Cody donated five dollars, um, so, so you can try, but Hummel right will now. attack you. <laughs> okay, can I like cunning save against his like attack? Um, like a little contention roll to unplug him. Let's see here. Hummel rolls a thirteen. Go ahead and roll a cunning save now. The fact that Sugi is held onto the box may save his friend here. Okay, so Suki, you kind of like you kind of kind of dodge two swings from Hummel, and you kind of rip that fucking ca- that cable out of that fucking um, that box, and the music ceases in, in your ears, Hummel. But the thing is, Suki, you're holding this cord, and you feel it kind of straighten out, and it's pulling your arm towards the ox hole. Give me a bronze save. Does Hummel see this? Yes, is, he is still recovering, though. Well, the music is oh, gone he- out of your ears now, and that purpose. F- Kind of just snaps away from you. I'm gonna see. Can I roll brain power to see if I'm all stunned? Sure. Because Seven. I feel like he would try and fight back, but I also know he's he seeks purpose. Now, nah, Hummel, you're 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 you 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 got filled with two divine purposes. You're kind of like can't get a backlash. And Sugi, you're like you're like you're full full muscled up trying to keep this cable. Now, I'm gonna say you stumble backwards here a few steps. Like, what the fuck? And you're stumble back this way. Now, Kumiko and Rue, you see you see Sugi in the in, in like the dim morning light, holding onto this fucking cable, and this cable's like wiggling towards the box he has in his hand, and it looks completely fucking wrong to both of you. Do you think maybe we should handle that? Maybe we should check it out. <laughs> yeah, good call. Almost so, we're going to over. so, uh, what's going on? Oh, fuck. Almost foaming at the Yeah. Mouth. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> Cursed magic item got the hobble again. Pull on toothpaste, please. Oh, gra- <laughs> oh no, he's, he's seizing shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll grab the end of this cord and say, Kumiko, you keep Hommel away from this. I know he's seizing right now, but we don't want to open up and just getting back into it. So, who's all grabbing so the cord? We'll, uh, I'm uh, holding Sugi. So Wait, Ru- no, I'm holding onto the box. I'm letting go of the cord if Ru has it. Oh, oh Ru's gonna. Okay, so Kimiko, what are you doing? I have been tasked with restraining Hamel. Okay. Yeah. Ron Wait. Ron. Wait, so is like the broken cord like dragging Hamel towards the box? Not, not broken. You, you simply, you, you, so you pulled the cord out of a little oh. ox hole. 
Um, oh, okay. It's just some. Uh, now, now, okay. Rue, now Rue, so right now, I've got the cord. He's got the box. Yeah, and so okay. here, it's a problem now. Now it's pulling. Now Sugi, the box is pulling you towards the cord. Rue, the cord's pulling you towards the box. I need bronze save from both of you again. Okay. Put your uh, coin purse in his mouth. What the fuck it. does that mean, broken? What, what kind <laughs> of coin purse? Is it innuendo? I think it is. <laughs> oh. Uh -oh. Ew. Uh -oh. Put my coin purse in your mouth, bro. So, uh -oh. so Sugi, you kind of go, you kind of jerked forward by this box, and Rugi like fuck, and trying to like turn, but the cord is still straight, kind of trying to get towards the box, and those those two cords. Slam together as the two cords slam together. I need Sugi and Rude to give me a brain power save. It was gonna take me to Funky Town. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. Funky Town. So Sugi and Rue are not knocked unconscious by the safety effect of the Walkman's Walkman. And this but it's now back together. And Sugi, as soon as that cord and box come together, you step awake. Sugi? Or... Oh. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, oh. oh okay. Is it... I, I hear the music. Wait, the, the, the thing's away from me, so... Um, okay. So I assume... Yeah. Su uh, say, I, I would assume yeah. Sugi had turned it off. <laughs> right. Right. Yeah. That's... I'm all like... like they, they were gonna take me... I hold my hand in my head. They were gonna take me to Funky Town, I think, or something? That was... So actually, you know what? Fuck it. You were, you were told that Funky Town is due southeast... On the eastern continent. <laughs> Funky. <laughs> to the southeast of the southern continent, there's a place called Funky Town that was going to take me there. Oh, now, the, the thing is... Now, sound like a good place, Bobby. Now, real quick, Hummel, uh, real quick, Hummel Brain Power save. But they were talking about it. Oh, oh nice. Nice. Smart. So, 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 so Hummel, you're like, like, oh. Oh, and like your head hurts? And you hear, take me to... Funky Town from way over by Sugi. And you're like, you can't look at it. And now, due to this particular role you made, you realize you're like, oh, and you, you feel dirty after having those things in your ear. And it's like, and, 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 and as you hear, dunk, 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 Funky Town, you feel like your skin crawl as if you just touch something very gross, as, as, as if you just full on palmed a tarantula on accident that you didn't know was there. Full on skin crawl. Oh, well. Almost, yeah, almost full body shivers and just like starts like brushing himself off. That was gross. Tuki, get rid of that. that Throw gross. it off the planet. That yeah. was disgusting. Right now. I, I think Funky Town is not a good place. I'm yeah. I'm gonna, gonna be like, hey, we're, we're gonna throw that in the pile. Uh, actually, no, I, I, I think I have a better plan for this. Uh, one that might be a little thing? more permanent than burning it. Uh, I what if we ticking. leave it for the little thing? I'm ticking. What? Yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to write a note on a piece of paper. I'm going to say, Dear Autodidact, don't put these on your ears. He's going to roll it up, shove it into the cartographer's note bag, and toss the Walkman <laughs> and the headphones into the wall. Into the, into the note see, 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 Matt Kemp? What the fuck? Because he's the one who found that last game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Matt Kemp's going to like, he's like, like, what now? Oh, the fucking, like, the unholy grill in his hands. Oh, my God. Oh, my he God. Says, oh, oh. Funky Town? Yeah. Dunk, 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 dunk. Town? Oh, like, no. like, what like, the fuck have you done? <laughs> <laughs> like a telltale heart. I can hear his heart in the floor. Like, 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 so uh, yeah, I'm in the I'm in the fucking foothold library. Yeah, I know. Oh, I just kind of <laughs> you I said open, the unholy grail the to the holy city. Like, oh, <laughs> <laughs> I just I'm, I, I pour it out in front of me. Am I? The, the mic what cut out. That? <laughs> the mic you peaked immediately. Really <laughs> <laughs> and, <they're, laughs> and they cut out immediately. <laughs> yeah, I yelled out castle. Yeah. <laughs> Castle. <laughs> so, 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 Is Hamo dead yet? Thank you, Busy. So, Sub Skywalker, like, eh? huh? What <laughs> so I mean, man, I'm so glad that I was able to, you know, save him from that curse from my past, and then. Uh, <laughs> these <laughs> people. Yeah, just note says, don't put these on your ears. <laughs> just don't. You oh, get a God. note back saying, "No shit, where'd you find them?" 
<laughs> He's gonna write on the underneath that <laughs> note on a corpse. <laughs> Do y'all see Rue pulling <laughs> notes out of that fucking bachelor bag, reading them, put it back in? <laughs> Do something. He's Let me gonna, see that. going to write on a corpse, and Hommel put it on his ears. We had to fight him for it. <laughs> <laughs> and then <laughs> Hommel put it on his head. Yeah. <laughs> Quick note back. What did he do? Uh, I don't know. What did he do? Stupid. What did he do? <laughs> yeah. He's going to turn to, to Suk and go, yeah, what did Hommel do? We what did you do? <laughs> oh, yeah. well, he, um, can I see the sun in the sky? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so he looked up. straight. Yeah, so he looked, uh, straight south. East. Southeast. Mm. And, uh. Down was that way. And, and then he. Points directly towards started, southeast. <laughs> he started saying weird down. shit. And tried to like beat, beat the shit out of me. I didn't yeah, try I to beat said, the shit out of you. I think he said southeast on on the southern continent or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Southeast southern <laughs> continent is where Funky Town lies. Yeah, I'll write that on a piece of paper and send it back to the auto die desk. If, yeah, if uh, I... he, he turned that way and <laughs> he is. <hissed laughs> Sugi. If Hummel hadn't rolled a nat 20, we would have derailed the entire campaign. I, I tell you right now. <laughs> we gotta find Funky Town. Good. Like, a literal fucking evil human on the ground. Like, yes, come to Funky Town. <laughs> Good, please tell me that what I pinged you is, is what he's hearing. Uh, oh, just listen to Funky Town. Uh, where at? Oh, my God. Chalk one? chat. What, what is this? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Oh. So, Hold on. So I'm almost here. It's gonna get claimed. Oh, that is perfect. <laughs> Dismiss. Jesus <laughs> Christ. James add this item in Dice and Demons. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No joke. Uh. <laughs> yeah. So now, now the specter of Funky Town looms over the fucking uh the party here because if that. If the auto die deck loses track of that fucking Walkman again, it's gonna be a fucking issue. Like Hobble dead asleep. Fucking town. East. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna wake up. He's I gonna be high on cocaine. So fuming, off into the fucking night. mad that Castle just like <laughs> get rid of it. So, so you guys don't know, but Castle is the queen of the the queen of, the, of basically the Skinwalkers, the Hornwalkers. So. Mm -hmm. in the last campaign, she was tasked with with, with safekeeping the Walkman. She's like, eh, <laughs> not a problem. Some orc has it. Some orc not got a problem it. anymore. Hey, I want to go to Funky Town. We got it. Why was the whole platoon so far east? I gotta go find Funky Town. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the funky town. I can't do the orcs accent. I gotta go to Funky Town. You fuckers work. left Troika just to return to Troika. That would be so fucked up. Fucking imagine. <laughs> like, hey, uh, this seems kind of familiar. Right. <laughs> Can I see that thing for a second? I want to send something to the other di the other didact. I'm assuming that's who you're talking He's gonna, to. He's going to kind of hold it back a little bit and go, uh, what do you want to send? Yes, a, a funny thing. I just want to send a joke. Can you take care of my bee stings? <laughs> my, yeah, my, I'll my take hair. care of your bee stings. Uh... <laughs> it's, it's <laughs> Actually, I think I... Meanwhile, meanwhile, Hobbit's going to have a bee sting. Go with fuck you, Dan. Fucking big-ass warts on his face. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, is something the humans, it is something the humans do to one another. It is a, a joke. See y'all laughing, and there's a fucking mad cap, and his fuckers like, they're like... <laughs> 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 I just he'll to hold out picture. he'll he'll hold out the end of the cartographer's document bag but he's not going to let go of it he's not going to put it in Hamel's hands actually right, Matt Cap, okay. so Matt Cap, before you leave the VC you you, you hear in the little, little tube never going to give you up never going to give on. you down never turn Hummel around draws... and desert you like inside the tube Hamel draws this and sends it to the autodidact draws what? I sent it, uh, I sent it, I sent it to you Mims I'll send it to you too, Gordon. Let me see. Jesus Christ. Oh I'll, my fucking God. I'll, I'll, God I'll, damn it. I'll, I'll show chat when it pumps up. I sent this to the autodidact. Madcap, you receive a so Madcap, you receive a dick butt in the fucking tube after you recover from <laughs> not just a dick butt, it's doing the hand thing too. 
Oh Jesus! I didn't realize that. You, you just <laughs> we'll got all just chat. Make like a sticky. We'll just take like so, a sticky note. So or something, a dick right? butt that's, that's throwing normal. up the three pillars at me. <laughs> Star Starla boys keep winning. <laughs> um, they're going to a little back sticky at... note, being like, oh, "That's from Hommel," and <laughs> just not from me. Okay, Fun. I didn't do that. He's going to think it's so funny, Rue. The humans do it to each other all the time, apparently. Or so I heard it. Basic. Um, I'm going to send. <laughs> I'm going to send a note. Now that I know that was Hamel, a friendly note. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Rue, I have approximately three old hours. <laughs> Rue will start tending. To, Rue will start tending to these things. Stop. I want Kamuka to say that line in character right fucking now. <laughs> <laughs> Please, Rue. I have approximately three whole owies. This, this Hamel was like probably like seventeen owies. <laughs> <laughs> little, little, little fucked up and big. So, Sugi. Approximately 19 out of 53 owies. <laughs> out of 53. So, so, Su <laughs> so hold on. R real quick, Sugi. You, after saving your friend's life in my fucking campaign, uh, you have stacked all the bodies up in the middle. Uh, what is your plan with all these fucking corpses? Um. Well, I'm like stacking them like neatly into rows or however I feel Allure wants them. Hold on. Okay, yeah. He's, he's not feeling creative today. A pile will do. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, and then I'm just going to slice the old hand open and just start summoning fire from my lantern, and I'm just going to keep pouring it over these corpses and uh, until there's dust for like four minutes. I'm just gonna burn them all up. Let me just yeah. read this spell real quickly. Yeah, and so while um, he's doing that, that one... what's the uh, yeah, what's the auto You're gonna want to prep some back. healing, Rue. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. On that note, that that final note is a little eyeball that uh, has a lightning bolt for its iris guard. It's silent sentry. Or what? Does the eyeball get eyes on Hummel? Oh. <laughs> so you're trying so try to watch Hummel via the silent sentry? Yeah, that I sent through the tube. <laughs> um, depends on if Sugi's able... Uh, if Sugi, if, if Ru points it towards Hummel. Let's see here. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. You get a pretty good look at Hummel, yeah. Rue would just be like, yeah, I don't know what this means, Hommel. I, I'm guessing you would know, and I'll hold it up to him. Can I, I, I have five in magical aptitude now. Can I, what do I roll for that? Oh, no. <laughs> Holy fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! So, just... Oh, no. As he gets struck by lightning, just... Holy fuck! That's, really that's gonna insta-kill me, isn't no, it? No, it's not. He's, he's gonna stabilize you, I assume. Yeah, of course. I'll just get struck by lightning. Oh, Suki, wait, 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 wait. Oh, Rudo, what's his arm? And then I get struck by lightning. <laughs> you, you know the fucking meme, like, ah! Then you fade away. Heads up, that. chuckle fox, big yeah, boy. Do I recognize it, through. though? Now, 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 real quick, Macab, I assume you're going to use the I want him alive trait, right? I am a kind man, but this kid is a problem child. I'm glad I chose not to teach him a fucking thing. <laughs> so you're like, oh like so, so, Rui, so, Rui went, so, so Rui went, hey, Hummel, look, and just <laughs> fucking bright blue flash out of fucking nowhere. <laughs> Get so, zapped, so, <laughs> Get zapped, stinky. So as you guys kind of shy out, away, chuckle, you see Hummel in the fucking. Man. You see Yamcha in the fucking. You see Hummel in the fucking Yamcha pose and a little crater in the ground. And apparently, 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 Madcap also sent pictures of Hummel's mom's feet. The tube? Uh, that, nah, that's somebody else saying some shit. Yeah, but Cody, Cody said it. So sorry, How bro. How the fuck do I know where? Did Damn, Cody knew it. 
I have divined your mother's feet. I knew exactly what they looked like. Well, she does live on the edge of the suicide bows in Troika, so it's could not. You, could you imagine, like, hey, but, hey, but, 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 but what you scrying? Feet. <laughs> like a giant crystal ball. <laughs> <laughs> what the? It brings a whole. It brings a whole new meaning to pondering my orb. Uh, autodidact. Why are you doing that for a thing? <laughs> Revenge. Why is there lotion next to your orb, autodidact? <laughs> But yeah, I would say. Blythe what are you doing? What are you doing, die. Step Didact? <laughs> Step Didact, why is there lotion next to your orb? Why are your pants off? Oh I am meditating. <laughs> I'm <am laughs> meditating. Pondering my orb. <laughs> That's what I said. There's a giant blue a... orb. It's back at like the one of It brings a whole new meaning to pondering my orb. That's what I had said. <laughs> fucking fucking um, Mac gas. Yeah. Fucking I don't know, like, covered like like old tissues, just like this. Doing too hard. I've seen too far. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Noble Game Master, so now I just I noticed that you are keeping this group this well away from water thing. and the angry women within that water. <laughs> Does it get magic card? No kidding. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, what, Badger, what, do, what do you mean? Like the, the, the fucking merfolk? No. <laughs> The dick butt. Imagine like this one bee stings Hommel and kills him out of nowhere. <laughs> one fatal damage. <laughs> ah! Please, please heal me, Rue, before Chad gets an idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm working on it. I'm working on it, buddy. Sh shock by lightning, death by a single bee sting in the fucking butt or some shit. Ah, ah, ah. Wait, all, all I can think of is, is, um, oh, I forget. My he died how he so lived. Dumb. Cringe as fuck. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so. Punishment dealt out. Campaign fucking saved by Sugi's quick thinking. Uh, <laughs> I, need to, I need to make a magical dick butt. A magic item. Yeah, 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 yeah. Butt plushy. I like how Hommel's the like a fucking the... minesweeper fucking like, hey Hommel, go touch that. Okay, it's cursed. Get him. <laughs> oh, no. I'll cast Trust. basic healing on Hommel to fix him up. That's, that's <laughs> fair. Almost twitching, like, I trusted Suki not to put on a cursed item. I think I trust people too hard, Rue. <laughs> I think I trust people too hard. So, Am Sugi, I, yeah, you I'm have... Be real with you, Hummel. I... Go ahead. So, Sugi, you, you, you have... So, hold on. Sugi, you've cleaned the battlefield. Uh, ash is all that awaits the plants here to regrow. Ash to ashes, cringe to cringe. Uh, and, yeah. <laughs> so... Hummel to Hummel. Hummel to Hummel. Hummel to Hummel. Hummel to Dick butt the dick butt. Oh man! <laughs> <laughs> no, it's so, hilarious. Though. So, so you laugh, but in, in in my unit, there's a big dick butt crisis that the the command hated. Um, there was a E two who had bought a hundred and seven <laughs> some absurd number of fucking dick butt stickers, and he was putting them on all the vehicles, on all, 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 all the control dashes. This, this is at Fort Polk. You can look it up. He was putting them at, at the gym. At fucking oh the command building, so he got CQ once. That's how they found him, because he put dick butts all over the Tenth Mountain Fourth Brigade BSTB command building. Uh, Jesus Christ! And yeah, and they're like, like, and like leading up to him, in, leading up to him getting staff duty. Um, they, they like, command was fucking boiling because they couldn't find this guy, and there were dick butts fucking everywhere. And like, <laughs> now the sergeant major, he laughed when he saw him. It's a big old black sergeant major with a bald head. He thought it was hilarious. The, <laughs> the officers did not find it so funny. Um, so uh. when they finally caught him, bro, like I've never seen someone get article 15 for a dick butt sticker, but they got him. To, oh, <laughs> he, 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 he went the E1 fucking pube patch. And it was like, they fucking like the, the captain, was it a captain or was it? Was, 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 one of the larger ranks was so mad they cut his fucking little Velcro patch off because they were determined he would never see E2. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, clearly what happened to Hommel. Not about dick butts, though, but... Sonny, you saw yeah, one? No, no shit! Butt. Look, look, look at chat. Sonny saw one at Fort cool. Polk. Let's fucking go! <laughs> oh, my God. Oh my God. <laughs> but, bro, That's they were sick. everywhere. Oh, my God. They were everywhere. <laughs> imagine, imagine, like, okay, because he's part of fucking... I'm, Pretty certain he was a fucking uh, mechanic, but you get into your fucking ASV, uh, and you go and look around, and there's like dick butt, dick butt, dick butt, dick butt, all the fucking like turret control panels, the fucking toggle switches. Like, what the fuck? You open up the back of the, the, the little hatch in the ASV, 
where you can get to the engine, you go clink clink, and there's a dick butt right on top of the fucking capital the engine is sitting there. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, I love this guy. I can't believe they they punished him so hard. He has a sense of humor. Bro, I don't know what happened yeah, to him. I really terrible. don't. I I don't know. I don't know what fucking happened to that guy. <laughs> He's I have no idea. They fucking, they, they fucking black backed him. Well, we all called him Private Dick Butt because he had no fucking patch. You knew who it was. Hey, Private Dick Butt. Hey, you know, <laughs> zero fucks given. Like it's just. Oh my god. Anyway, uh, Dick Butts aside, you guys have a single vehicle. No supplies. Uh, mission mission I... done. But I will say one thing. I will say one thing, though. Um, Moonin, ignoring all you guys as per usual, it's been, been on the radio. <laughs> um, so I had a big script up for Moonin, and I, I'll kind of move it. But uh, Moonin finds out that you guys have blunted an attack on two of the outposts and have more or less caused <laughs> an offensive to halt. <laughs> On the roadway. I'll go to... Uh, where is it? In the north. So, <clears throat> you guys successfully uh, blunted a spearhead attack. So, right where you guys are, right? Yeah, right there. You guys successfully blunted... I guess I'll take the dragon wagon away. <laughs> Put that right there. Uh, yeah. You guys successfully oh, blunted an attack here and kept the attack from rolling into this outpost and this outpost. So, so you have successfully inadvertently halted a fucking spear point attack onto the two, these two outposts and blunted the offensive overall, which allowed these two forward cops to react and assault the blunted, halted units because their command structure <laughs> was just gone. Their goal was to go out and just steal supplies and kill folks. You guys, with your double 50, completely whacked their peepees, more or less. Um... <laughs> <laughs> and uh, more or less, you were like, like, hey, you know, you, I'm going to paraphrase. You guys did a great job, but uh, your mission is going to be altered. You need to return as soon as possible to, uh, let's see here. What, hold on. Yeah. We did something right for once. We, yeah. <laughs> I well, fear the mule potion that's going to ruin that. You, you almost summon an elder god from the ground, but yeah, he did something right. Hooray. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> So the, oh, that so the walking man is first, I got the idea from a Simon R. Green book called uh, The Night Side. The walking man is the holy warrior who was who was more or less co-opted by a rogue demigod and was using him to more or less attack the main pantheon. And it took mm -hmm. uh, multiple human warriors wielded by the dwarven pantheon to stuff that fucker in the ground and tear off his walking man. Because remember, human music has power. And he had unlimited access to human music, so he's able to wield it. Oh no! But they, but more or less, these these six la fucking lancenecks. So they are still alive, chat. Uh, you know, but six German lancenecks in full regalia were fighting a 1980s American human with a fucking power of music. They eventually this is regular <laughs> show. And 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 and, and, and yeah, it is. It's literally a regular show. And, and they eventually were able to take that shit off his head and kind of kill him and kind of bury him in the ground. So the walking man's walking man summons a sacrifice to where he's buried so he can take their power of soul and return back to the land of the living. So if Suki hadn't <laughs> saved your ass, Hommel, you would have derailed my entire fucking campaign. <laughs> uh. Say, I wasn't going to put it on, but then Suki wanted to put it on me. <laughs> okay, but I saved you. But! No. <laughs> But, 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 did you but, I, yeah, exactly. but I own reverse card, so you're fine. <laughs> okay, also, we both know how I would have put that shit on in the middle of the night and disappeared. No, I'm, yeah. I, would, yeah. I would not have. See, I'm, I'm like, <laughs> Funky Town, let's go. Do, do, do. Fucking yeah, walking on the grass. There's grassland. a reason why I sent it straight to the auto die to act. <laughs> yeah, yeah you, you sent the Holy <laughs> City a literal fucking hydrogen bomb. Like, <laughs> oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Oh, oh shit, God, here we go bomb. again. Pipe Oops. Pipe bomb. Oops, all pipe bombs. Uh, Meanwhile, a screaming <laughs> oh, man just probably opened up in the library between the autodidact and Saab being like, what the fuck? What is that doing so here? I... Get it out! <laughs> we need to find the quickest way actually... back to Cop Stormhorn? Yeah, so yeah, so more or less, you're like... you're being ordered to return to Cop Stormhorn for debrief. Uh, okay. They are not upset the dragon wagon has been destroyed. They're just kind of really annoyed, but they know it's not. They know it's not your fault. 
you know? Yeah. yeah. Is there any way we can get the bullpup off of the uh, dragon wagon? No. Like, just strip the dragon wagon for as much no. as we can? No. Can we get any fuel, any kind of supplies off of it? It big brokey. Big brokey? Well, all the fuel has been no. busted after I, you know, dragged the After I dragged around. a fucking dark sun around the field, like, oh, look, fire. <laughs> I'll melt Wait, so dragon wagon. Um, go ahead, I'll, uh, yeah, go ahead. Here we go. Uh, no, Sonic had something probably first. I I just want to know how melted the dragon wagon was. It's a bit crispy, <laughs> say the least. Bit crispy. Bit crispy. So would it go? be better for us to reverse our track or keep going the way that we planned? That's up to you. It might be better to go the way that we planned. Um, just because, like, we're already heading in that direction. That way, there we can just avoid the minefield that we already tried to avoid. Um, mm -hmm. It seems like it should just get a little bit more peaceful on the way back. Because if we blunted an offensive, then the orcs and the fae are going to be uh, on the back foot for a little bit. Either that or they're looking out for our van. Uh, so, regardless of which way we take, it's going to be the same risk, regardless. The only, the only reason that I would think that we might want to. Well, no. Actually, scratch that. No, I was gonna say we could take the extra supplies that we dropped off at the previous checkpoint, but that still needs to go up the chain to the people who are doing the offensive now, <laughs> or yeah. the blunting it. it. My thought is the only reason I'd want to go back would be to brag to that one officer who got a little snippy with me about uh, leaving extra supplies with them. That uh, you know, got hey, a little uh, snippy with we you. ran into some guys. <laughs> well, got, well, yeah, got a well. Snippy with me, but come, uh, check it come, out. Back. Who well, well, spoiled well, the fucking well. enemy. Mm -hmm. Check it out, motherfucker. Look what I did. Look what we did. <laughs> uh, sorry the dog's back. Fucking goddamn it. Was I'd have, yeah, God I have a question. Yeah, what's up, Amal? What are we going to do about the uh, insubordination or the attempt on the uh, that guy's life that uh, we were running away from when we first left? Well, from what we heard, it sounded like they got to the truth of the matter pretty quickly that somehow his hat attacked him. Oh, um, my God. Yeah, it should be fine. And regardless, anything that, like, they bring up against us should only be brought up against me, so it'll be fine either way. Right, okay, good. We are not returning to a steaming pile of shit, good. I mean, we might be. We you very probably, we yeah. very, well, very well might be, but we'll see what happens. <laughs> also, I imagine these guys can resupply from the orcs that they kill mercilessly. This is true. The so the orc forces this you guys wouldn't know this, but orc forces have learned they send those guys in dry and come out dry. They they go they come back weighing less out of pure ammo. They more or less sustain themselves off the land that way they don't give the enemy fucking anything. Mm. Oh, that sucks. Right. Uh, we may have to just do that if we want to survive trekking back. So do we want to take it slow and? Do some hunting or and or gathering. Yeah, we could do some of that on the way there. Some uh, hunting just and that we don't run out of. Yeah. <laughs> Probably <laughs> both. Me pick Mario. <laughs> yeah, we can kind of pick our way up back there, but um, we will want to be back there sooner rather than later. So I was hoping we could like harvest some fuel from the dragon wagon to power the. <laughs> Shaggin' wagon, but uh, the stormboard is so far. It is. Uh -huh. It's so far. We didn't, we're um, gonna have to track it anyways. So. Yeah. Are we just are we just gonna one eighty our asses out of here? No. Uh, we need. We should to... probably take the shortest way to the biggest uh, settlement in Louise. So are, are these tanks little stops? Those are your camps, yeah. Okay. Is there any camps on the way up here, or like? The way we he just deleted them. Um, oh yeah, yeah well the yeah, they're they're, they're that, along the way. Okay. They're along the way. It's fine. Yeah, what okay. I'm thinking is there's only three stops until Louise, and we'd be able to resupply pretty easily. At I'm thinking we should be able to resupply at Louise, but I don't know what size yeah. it is. Well, you guys were the resupply for those places, by the way. Yeah, yeah but at the town, not the points. Oh, you there said you wrote up a document. Issues. So, so if we, oh, we were supposed to be delivering supplies. We we're supposed to be doing a round trip. Yeah, yeah but not. Yeah. So to these, these three all... points, not to this town, right? So yeah, we can resupply no, 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 in this no, town. Those three points. Okay. Yeah. 
That means that yeah. there's no fuel for us for the Shagan Wagon at those three points. However, if we go south, there should still be fuel left at those camps that we dropped off. But they wouldn't be able be... to give it to us anyways. Yeah, they'd need every bit they can get. The people up north are going to need it more. Because we were supposed to be giving them anything. They have nothing. Mm. Zip. Well, how through these I mountains, think... estimating based on the path that we just took, how long do we think, like map-wise, it's going to take us to get to Luis? Asking me that? Yeah. To Luis? Uh, so... Thing is, there'll be like no stops if we just drive through. So oh, straight through. Oh, oh man. Um, you pressure. guys may be rolling in on Hamel pushing your wagon going to Louise. Yeah. Why Hamel? But we'll make it, right? <laughs> if, Even if yeah. we have to stop Hold like on. a day or two. Hold out. on. Hold on. Hold on. If you dump the turret and the 50s, you might yeah. make it. Yeah. <laughs> I know what you're doing, guard. Don't no, no, no. I'm saying like the the weight the weight of that turret and the two dual fifties and the ammo cans and the actuator and the motor. You guys dump that shit. It'll reduce weight by a shit ton, and you guys I might more... make it to Louise. I am, you know, at that point, if we're stripping off the fifty, we might as well just like let Kumuko walk. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to suggest we rip out the vibrating bed, but damn. Nah, we need that. Make the spider walk. No touch 50s. God damn. All right. <laughs> oh, yeah. Is that Shaggin' Wagon repaired? So, yeah, yeah. So, a certain secret pit crew has completely repaired and refueled the adventure. I guess you're curious. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, so, it's a full tank. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, you have 18 fuel Ooh. units currently. It takes us two fuel units per thing. Well, um, we're it's, it's that, six. Maybe. It's six fuel units per two map grids. Okay. okay. And, so I, and I and I and I believe I believe you guys are covered some fuel. One of you guys had written it down, so we want to find out who had it written down. I sure as hell didn't. How do you get it to to place again? You go, you drag, Please. and then you. I believe you do alt, oh. or is it shift? What do you? What do you do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, we have to so, spend so, so, all of it to so, get to the to this one here. So, drag, hold down alt, click, and it should keep clicking along. So, see, the thing is, um, what, why, why, why are we wanting to go to Louise, guys? There's no, there's no fuel along the way. There's, fuel there's no along fuel the way back the way either, though. There is though. There's not. They're going to use it. They needed enough fuel to last them to the next resupply, which is probably... It's also a farther trek down to... Uh, down this way to... What does that say? I can't see with the red triangle. Virium? We're not, we're not going there. We're going to Jigo. But we'd have to cut through a forest and go off-road, which is probably going to take even more fuel. And who oh, knows? Jikum oh. is a smaller town. Jikum. <laughs> they might not have vehicle. F they might not have vehicle fuel there. I see. I see. We um, have no food for your steed. Um, well, so old dude worst case scenario, we'll we'll take gas from their operating vehicles or something. Do we have the authority to do that? I mean, we got the um, moon instead. Hey, Bob! Why can't the tank move? Some dick in the van took our fuel. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Hypothetically speaking, we could just have Moon and do it. I'm sure he's shifty enough to get it. Third. I'll just use this. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> the bird's not here to defend dun, himself. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> oh, wait. If I recall correctly, if we at any point ran out of fuel, we were, we were able to call in uh, refuels from like. Thank RBS God. Someone yeah. fucking. I've been waiting forever for all of these to just pop a flare off. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Well, so we why don't we just. Players? Thanks, Drive along, and we don't have to worry about stealing from anybody. We can just call it in. We can, looking at it, it's thirty feet. Uh, well, thirty feet, what? quote unquote, to this one right here. Uh, if it's three, yeah. Uh, if, if it's three per, and it's three times five, we'd be using fifteen. We'd be able to make it here, and maybe a little bit beyond. 
just off of what we have, just the 18 units. If we called in a, re a refuel, had them refuel the truck, then it's another... Uh, I can't read my own thing because there's like five five people doing stuff. Sorry. Uh, like 25. It, it's okay. I'm not I'm not angry. Uh, it's like 25 to the next and then another 20 to Louise. So we would be able to just keep calling in refuels because they want us to get back to Stormhorn. It would make sense for them to send out Harpies specifically saying, hey, get these fuckers back to Stormhorn. Um, I don't know if that's like, the actual case, though. <laughs> What do you want to know? Uh, I can't remember. Play. How many players did we get? Already. Uh, so, cool. I'm hungry. I'm going to go eat some Dunkaroos in the back. <laughs> and then... Whatever Dunkaroos are. Uh, you guys can, like, clear out some space for yourselves. I have a lot of shit just laying around. I go to the bench seat, and I just start walking back to the vehicle. By the way, I don't know if I can drive anymore. I kind of feel funny after having a weird dream, and I get in the I get in the dragon wagon. Oh, yeah. Well, the dragon wagon. Dragon wagon. Sorry. Dragon wagon. Okay. Wrong uh, wagon, bro. Yeah, I'll 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 be doing the uh the driving. Hummel, you can hang out in the turret. Uh, Kumiko, you can <laughs> hang out in the back because I'm driving. As far as sleeping orders goes, not all of us are going to be able to sleep in the van, so we're going to have to camp outside anyways. If uh, nobody else is in the back of the van while I'm in here, I can make some tarps, tents for us. Some beanie yeah, weenies. Outside. That'd be good. <laughs> uh, Moonin can keep us on track. Rue can do whatever Rue does. Rue will sit in the passenger seat, I guess. Uh, there's three seats up front. It's a bench. Oh. And Hummel's oh, okay. taking one. Oh, yeah, right. the shotgun, sort of. Yeah, well, there's shotgun, and then there's the little seat in the middle. Uh, oh, it's like my dad's old Ford. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, there's a guy who's like the sandwich beat. Look, I don't feel comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess it'll be um. And then somebody Sugi, has to Hummel, and Moonen in the front. Then Ruin can go in the back. Or yeah, somebody, right? need, somebody needs to be in the turret. I'm in the oh, turret. Okay. Oh, okay. Ah, okay. Cool. So Hummel's in the turret, then Rue will be up front. Couldn't go in the back. Sounds like a plan. Alright. Uh, yeah. I'm... I know these guys are hungry, too. I'm gonna check the cabinet. See if there's any food in there. Uh -huh. <laughs> Singular thing of Jif peanut butter. <laughs> Some Oreos. There is a... Oh, yes. There is a single bottle of extra crunchy peanut butter inside that fucking cabinet. <laughs> oh, <else>, yeah. <laughs> Don't give it to the dog. No. Right. <laughs> she, 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 <laughs> blah, blah, blah. I hate this shit. Yeah. Hey, Kimiko. Kimiko, uh, uh, crack open some of that uh, heart attack and our rations in the back and uh, spread some of this on it. Yeah. Do you have any Wonder Bread? Uh, I don't know. The cabinet didn't have Wonder Bread this time. I don't know what that the is. The cabinet still open, so you gotta close it and find out. I'll close it and open it up again. See if there's Wonder Bread. Please. Make some fucking TV face. There is oh. a there is a loaf of rye bread that pops up. The, the oh. van the, the the van's kind of rattled right now. There's a hold on. Actually, there is a loaf of rye bread in a single, kind of oddly smallish Dunkaroo. It's size for your paramour. <laughs> right, well, I'm gonna hand that off to my shoulder. And then I'm going to dunk her to the shoulders to sit in there. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna grab my combat knife and this bread and hand it to Kumuko and ask her to make sandwiches. Okay. <laughs> There's a joke in there. So Kumuko, you have rye bread, <laughs> extra chunky peanut butter, and you're watching this package go <laughs> on fucking Suki's shoulder. What do you do? <laughs> Mind my business and make some sandwiches and then <laughs> do my fucking job later. I mind my own fucking business mind and make some sandwiches. I mind my own fucking business. I mind my business and make See, Kuko, like, shh, shh. <laughs> fucking making a sandwich. Tell that woman get back in the I kitchen. I will whip out the sandwiches sandwich. in like two minutes flat, just whip them in the front seat, and then I'll start working on the thing that I said I was going to work on. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> First, first, give me cooking and brewing with your brain power, and then give me your your silk roll. Okay, okay. That's so, like, you're like, you're like going, shh, roll, right? you're kind of looking over your shoulder. You see, like a, like a dunk root kind of go, into nothing. See, like crumbs kind of fall I... down Suki's shoulder. Yep. There we go. 
And you said brain power? <laughs> yeah. Da, 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 da. I wasn't clicking on my thing, so... Could you imagine it a peanut butter sandwich with rye bread? <laughs> Fuck it. No. <laughs> Actually, I've tried it. It's not that bad. Mm. This tastes like poverty. Peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Polish style. Okay, oh, so... No, I use the Jewish rye bread. <laughs> so, Kumiko expertly crafts some <laughs> chunky peanut butter and rye bread sandwiches. Uh... Sorry, I'm, 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 I'm talking to eggplant. Um, and, uh, <laughs> yeah, so you guys get your sandwiches made, and Kumiko, give me your ra your racial roll. Yep. <laughs> Slur. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't been eating well. <laughs> I've only had peanut butter in pain. Yeah. Uh, hold on. I have a hold uh, one second, guys. I got to talk with the, with the fucking book artist, so stand by. <laughs> Take your time. I gotta ask, Madcap, um, how did the autodidact react when Rue handed him just this bundle of fabric with the bride inside of it? Uh, I was, I've been curious. He knows the, he knows the score. Okay, it's, fair enough. <laughs> this guy, if you know anything about the previous campaign, he knows cursed items. <laughs> it's one thing fair I know, enough. it's fucked up shit's gonna kill my friends, let me tell you. <laughs> and no, Cody, it's a racial just... role, not a racist role. <laughs> Why is this D twenty so fucking crude? Because I functionally guy? handled it, handed him like a ball of fabric. <laughs> <laughs> so Kumiko, like you know what, like you said, haven't been eating. Well, you get stung by a bee. You're a little off your game. Uh, you kind of just have a wash of your first heads up, Chuckle Fox, big oh, boy me. coming through. I got Tom has activated uh, a mule potion. Hold on. Uh -oh. Mighty Balding Goliath blocks the path to the party's destination, stops the party with his many powerful beasts while riding one huge brown bear. Jesus. And challenge one of them to, to slug thighs, out Cody. Duel to have you seen who's drawing it? The victor a melee focus. <laughs> uh, hold on, fellas. Now, Sugi, can you move that van around or no? Yeah. Okay. As far as you need to go. Well, go ahead and do your full... So you have 18 units of fuel in your gas tank. You move mm -hmm. two grid squares per six fuel yes. units. So move yourself where you want to go. Move six grid units. One, two, and then we were going to stop here. You're going to stop there? Damn. Okay, so you did, so so you only use burnt up six fuel units then? Correct? Mm-hmm. Okay. So as you were driving down the road, you're kind of looking around, you know. Uh, <laughs> Tom, a mighty balding Goliath blocks the path. And he blocks the path due to the fact he is riding a giant brown animal, which looks like some kind of lamb predator. You can't, you can't quite sure. make it out. And he holds out his hands in a big gesture, as if saying for you to stop. Oh, eyes up. Eyes up. I don't not feel confident in these things anymore, but I'll do my best. Doesn't matter. They're loaded, maintained. So, Hommel... Uh, I'm going to slow down on the car. Gotcha. Say, hold your fire. So, Hommel, you see this giant Goliath, a mighty balling Goliath, might I add, riding this giant fucking big brown predator animal with arms held out pretty rough looking customer what do you do i i i, I hold out who are you and i i hold up my hand and it's almost in a cupping motion how far is he like how many feet cupping motion like you're gonna don't worry about it how many how many feet is he for me <laughs> 30, 30, don't worry about it motion. gm 30 feet okay good all right i i i i i hold my my hand out kind of in like a uh, like i'm cupping an orb of some kind uh who who are you what what why do you want us to stop we are military the good guys he goes my name is wario and i oh, no. am here to give great power to those who deserve it Right, and who is deserving of it? Whoever can beat me in a hand-to-hand -hand fist of cuff. Hand-to-hand -hand fist of cuffs? Ru! Ru, do you hear him? 
Oh. I don't know why you're looking at me. Hey, <laughs> she, 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 she's doing one of these, like... Can I, can I? See? <laughs> no, oh, I mean, you're bro, asking me if you can. If... Um, I mean... Wait, can well, you well, he'll kind of lean out the passenger side window. He'll go, what kind of power are you offering? I bring boons of items to those deserving of their power. So how how um, how clean does these fisticuffs have to do? Because I bet you I could bring you to your knees right now. If you are so cowardly as to use that weapon against me, then you are no not weapons. worthy of my no. boons. No weapons. I no weapons. I just have a, a tickle, a, a feeling. What does that even mean? I can yeah, show Rune's you. Yeah, looking at you too out the out the passenger side window. What I can gladly you show about? you. I just don't want it to make me unworthy. Sorry, I'm back. No problem. He goes. I am here. Want to do it? I'm all good for it. To challenge those who I deem worthy, and I believe that one of you in that wagon are worthy of being challenged and given my oh. boons. Hold up. If we give you no. peanut butter sandwiches, Hobble. will you let us pass? Hobble. I love Hobble. peanut butter. <laughs> However, Hobble. it is not part of what I am doing. However, afterwards, I will definitely partake in your peanut butter and orange slices if you have them. Oh, man, I wish we did. All right. What? 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 Ah. Ah. How, how fucked up is Hamel still? Is he healed yet? No, you're no. still pretty fucked up. <laughs> you have like 10 HP right now, brother. I was healing him with very healing. Uh, he should have been recovering like D10s. Oh. Uh... So Wario goes, oh, I so cannot healing. let you pass this point without my challenge being answered. Sugi, I want to fight him, but I need to know how fucked up Hummel. I am. Hamel. Hamel. You remember no. that mask? No, 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 no. So, oh, so, so, Sugi, you you hear your paramour put on her mask. She goes, I think it's time he met the King of the Ring. I think it is time for the King of the Ring. Rue? Rue? Rue, I'm going to get us through here. All right. Listen, I'm going to level with you both. I'm not really caring too much which of you does it. I just want to get home. <laughs> hey, hey, Rue, hey! I need you to, I need you to, I need you to reach under that uh, passenger, the passenger side for me. It should be under uh, the uh, the seat. Oh, okay, yeah, sure. The wife we'll reached down, grabbed the mask, and hand it over to you, Zuki. Okay, and I need you to grab that um, that thermal blanket from the uh, the glove box. A thermal blanket. And he'll open the glove box. And... Oh, oh, it's okay. Like, I didn't know. It's just, it's There's a lot like a, of room in this glove box. It's really it's weird. Like a, it's just like a chrome thin blanket. <laughs> and right. yeah, he'll hand that over to you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wrap the thermal blanket around my chest like a cape after I strip off my shirt. <laughs> you get down to your underwear? No, no. Wait, yeah, actually, I got the, I got the, I got my, my tidy whiteies. My boots in the cape. Then I'm gonna don the mask. Um, guard, would it be okay for this mask to have two extra like like metal oni horns that fit around my other one so I have the three horns? In the in the sure. <laughs> sure. Okay. That that was part of it. It's like a like like you know, like Oni King. Mm hmm Of course. <laughs> I'm gonna step out. In front of the man. Thy king has to match a challenger, eh? And then I'm gonna get to like a low grappler pose. So Wario Welly kinda goes, I do believe you are the kind of challenger that I have been waiting for. And he dismounts his fucking grizzly bear. <laughs> and he goes, I do believe we roll in the same circles. And he pulls up this giant bear head and pulls it over his face. And now you're both now the van's witnessing two <laughs> two wrestling uh agents about to go at each other. Uh he goes, if you believe 
You are worthy of meeting the bear head on. By all means, come and learn. You're about to get royally owned, buddy. You're, you're fucking paramore. Yeah, royally owned! <laughs> Jesus. Rue, press the triangle. Turn the knob all the way to the right. Tri triangle? Oh, you mean this one? He'll kind of press it. <laughs> and he'll turn the knob. <laughs> He doesn't Let's know how this fucking what, thing operates. What, what music is playing? Yeah. I, I don't... Uh, <laughs> Girls and Tiger. Tiger. I have no idea. Like, fucking... Like, I, got, I got it. My brain... I got an idea. My brain says Rocky music at this point. <laughs> Rocky, yeah. This point? Gotta be right. Hold on. I, I was saying I want to play it, but I know we can't, because we're going to get fucking copyright struck. Pool, yeah. Pool's closed. Pool's closed. <laughs> 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 uh, so that's a really good song. So yeah, sure. Pulls clothes begins playing over the speakers as Sugi and and Wario meet, and it's basically the silver mask and the big cloak meeting this giant bear head in hand to hand combat. Now, Sugi, go ahead and roll me initiative, and I'll just uh, fuck you. I guess we're just rolling. Uh, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. Oop, nope. You're gonna roll a seven. Okay. I am going to fucking wing this shit. <laughs> uh, let's see here. It's a d20 plus five for everything else. Eight. Thirteen. Okay. So I am gonna beat you initiative by one, Sugi. Now, we're going to start off with a big boom, grappler check as both your hands grab onto each other. The 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 bear and the pious leper meet, meet, meeting in the outside ring. Go ahead and roll me a CQB check, Sugi. That's with your CQB and brawn. Sorry, a grappling check with your CQB and brawn. All right. I don't have CQB. I just have brawn in a dream. Brawn, dream. brawn in a dream apparently is enough. No, that, that was my roll, 22. Oh. Ha. Oh. So you rolled a 13. I'm trying to boogie, but the fucking uh, <laughs> we like now. the boogie. So no, so Sugi hasn't, so Sugi hasn't rolled yet. The thirteenth mine, the twenty-two's mine. Ten. So oh, man. so warrior goes. It appears you have some things you still must learn. And you guys watch as he picks Sugi up by his hands, woof, and holds him over his head. He's gonna do a wrestling move on Sugi. He's going to by your hands hold you up and then start rolling backwards. He's going to body slam you onto the ground. Uh, wrestling moves are a melee combatant movement, I believe. And it converts. Mm. Let's see here. My... So, with my touch, I can kicks. Do, is there like any like acrobatics I can do? With your what? To, like, can I like acrobatics out of like wrestling moves or like anything? Because mm. I know it's like wrestling counters that you can do. So, go ahead and let me. Let me go ahead and give me an, 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 an a uh, acrobatics and cunning check then, because I'm gonna have you try and beat his hit rolls. Give me one second here. So, two, Ooh. yeah, his CQB roll will probably roll oh, by one. Uh, okay, so you guys watch as this giant bear of a Goliath is picks up Sugi and body slams on on, on the. Uh, on the ground, onto his back, mind you. So he, all your air just poof, leaves your lungs, Sugi. Um, as, as he does this, this is going to do 2d12 plus brawn. So uh, doop, that's 2d10s. Doop, doop. X plus 5. It's a hard shatter. 28 points of blunt damage. And he only has one move per turn. So Sugi, go ahead. Thank you. Well, he's going to do something else every turn, but yeah. So he's currently powering up. So you have uh, all your AP, 15. What do you do? Mm -hmm. Spellcasting would break the rules of the agreement, except for the chair, which is a finisher. <laughs> Don't say finisher. Which is a finisher. It's a <laughs> oh, Jesus. He said we're in the same ring, so he's, he's aware of the rules here. Is grappling until you until until it's the finish, which is bad. I don't want to get hit with this finishing move. Um, I'm agile. I'm smaller than this guy. 
fucking anime looking ass. I have feet on my thigh. <laughs> Are you the fastest I'm... in the game, Sugi? Me? Did you unlock dual wielding? Come on, I'm sorry. Bad jokes. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> fucking crossing field starts playing in the shag night. <laughs> Can I come on next, please? I'm at least just playing anime openings. <laughs> I do have I have the fucking shirt on. Wait. No, I, I have the shirt on. This is <laughs> But though it's she on it. I got the anime shirt on. I'm not just shirtless. The fucking that, tank my, top. that my tidy whitey's in a chrome cape. <laughs> hey, hey, oh, just man. for you, just for you, Suki, almost gonna start humming uh a, a, a Goliath rendition so, of, of so, crossing fields. So real quick, Sugi, are you are you currently only in your tidy whities and cloak, or no? I'm in my tidy whities, my anime shirt, <laughs> my anime tank top, the mask, and the chrome cloak. So due to a mule, I would increase your DR to 18 due to the fact you're wearing your underwear. Um, okay, so... Sugi, you're now DR 18. Okay. What are your attack actions? Oh. Okay. I'm going to. So I'm on my back. Uh huh. I'm going to full. I'm going to forward roll. In between his legs, and as I'm on the ground, I'm going to push up, with my with my hands. And like, donkey kick him in the back of the knees. <laughs> okay. It's simultaneously. I'm gonna call that a disabling strike. Because they're kicking towards the the the, the joints, so mm -hmm. go ahead and roll to hit with your CQB and brawn. So you said I have God and anime on my side. Oh, oh fuck! Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! God has abandoned. Sweetie. So your paramour goes, wait, wait, no, 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 no! As you you kind of go a bit too forward, you kind of you kind of over lunge yourself, and you kind of you kind of end up face planting into the guy's bear, and, 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 and the bear kind of goes raw, raw, and kind of like grabs you and kind of turns around and pushes you back towards the uh, towards Wario. Wario is going to get an, uh, one of his special actions here that I've written in real quick. He's going to use the, the 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 weight of the push from the bear to do another wrestling move on you. So Sugi, give me give me another acrobatics and cunning check as he tries to 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 wrestling move you. Now so who's my good boy? Can you beat Sorry. a motherfucker? Okay. My internet crash. So if you can get above him, you'll get a free attack on him. You do. So you get a free wrestling move on him as he fails to take an initiative on your weight being thrown towards him. So what is the what is the the the, the 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 wrestling move you do? Flying arm bar. Wait, Thank like you. a so like I'm just gonna like jump in the air. Well, I'm gonna use the momentum, right? And the boots make me lighter. Actually, yeah. And so I'm just gonna like go for my uh my arm around his his throat, like as like I'm going in the air to like, you know. <laughs> okay. And then, <laughs> and then I'm going to use that weight to wrap around and get on his back and put him into a chokehold. Okay, roll me two d12 plus brawn for your damage for your for your flying arm bar. In in Hummel, I I really do hate how your fucking thing quotes me when you log in. I just I, I hate that. I'll change it eventually. <laughs> yeah, you, you're not going to change it at all. Don't lie to me. <laughs> Nine? No, no. So wrestling moves is two d twelve plus brawn, Suki. I thought you said two d four. My bad. No, two d twelve plus brawn. So you have a brawn of three. So two d twelve x plus three. One day I'll get it. Will be one more d twelve. <laughs> You're at eight so far. Why is that not? You are cringe. Sixteen damage. All right. So you successfully arm bar the fuck out of fucking Wario, who kind of falls back on the ground with a big rush of air. Uh, was what was your next move? Because right now you are at uh, let's see, moves are f uh, six AP. One, two, three, four, five, six. You're at nine AP left. Oh, thank you, baby. Uh, 
Sorry, just a good trick there. Oh, Fine. there goes my hat. Okay. So he's on the ground. Yeah. Um. Right. Mm-hmm. Can I hit him with an atomic elbow? Sure. Uh, go ahead and roll hit via CQB and brawn. Sorry. Okay. Hold on, I'm on a stroke. One second, one second here. Hold on. Sorry. CQB and tap tack fighting. I changed that a long time ago. Yeah, so CQB and tap tack fighting. Does anybody tap tack fighting on your sheet? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so roll tap tack. You don't, you don't have any. You nerd. That's just, that's just flat D20. Yeah, okay. So flat D20 with your uh, CQB. All right, so I'm assuming there's no wrestling moves I can do that would involve, like, acrobatics or anything. Mm. There's no ring around you, so it's kind of like a, a dirt circle, so not really. If there, if there was, like, a ring ring there or a post, and yeah, but... Middle, middle, mm. You're in the middle of a road. How close is the... Wait, can I, like, jump onto the top of the, the wagon? <laughs> sure, yeah. If it do... Do like a front flip into like a, like like a drop kick onto his like you know onto his head. Okay, in that regard, all of you watch as Sugi hops in the front of the fucking chicken wagon and jumps off of it, rocking <laughs> on suspension. Roll me acrobatics and cunning to, to see if you land correctly. Another net one. That'd be funny. Um, so you land solidly. Now roll me again two d twelve plus brawn. Nice. Okay. One, two, three. So you land squarely on this giant Goliath man. You do you do kind of land whack. You're now you're kind of floating on this giant dude. Uh, you have three AP left. What do you want to do? Um. How beat up does he look? He looks like he's enjoying himself. <laughs> this man okay. feels alive. <laughs> uh, I'm assuming I've used my movement after the, you know, the, the jumping off. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, is there like a brace action? Or like like a dodge? Like, like, like hold an action to like dodge? Sure. Or to like move out of the way? I'll give you a, a held action to try and react to him coming at you as a sound. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Wario goes, I see I have chose the right road, as he kind of hips up onto his feet and turns around with his fucking hands out. Um, He's going to run at you and scoop you up. So go ahead and give me be a cunning save for your saved action. Okay, flat cunning. Flat cunning. I will give you advantage on your grapple check now using CQB and brawn. Okay. So he is going to roll. 17. He's a Goliath, so I'll do it again for my advantage. Because you are smooth. So it's 27. Yeah, so you got to be at 27. So give me that, that grappling roll twice. We have the same large. Uh, we have the same size class, right? We're both large. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. true. No change. Think and face then... him. What the fuck does that mean? Oh, I'm not gonna do that. The fuck's a stink face? <laughs> Show his ass in his face. I don't know. <laughs> Fourteen. Oof. So. Scoops you up, boom, and he kind of pulls you up like this. He's holding you like this. And he's running towards the van. Now, Rue, you see this giant bearskin wearing Goliath running towards the van with, with, with fucking Sugi in his arms. How much, you see the exact same thing. Kumiko, I assume you can see this. So, what do the three of you do as he's rushing and wielding Sugi towards the van? Uh, hop out the passenger side and go to find a flower for his befriend. 
There's literally <laughs> nothing Rue can do. That wow, is literally that sucks. Get to, nothing get to the van. Throw, throw it, away. throw it, throw it into reverse. I don't Rue know. Doesn't know how to drive. Rue sucks at driving. He's gonna crash it. Can uh, actually, I have an idea. I crash What's that? The windshield. Wrestlers love rope because they can jump off of it, right? So he won't jump off of our car if I take the pitiful amount of webbing I have and string it in front of the car, right? <laughs> like real fast. You want to spider scrabble out of the van to hold out your rope in front of the van? <laughs> well, like string it for because we're presumably in like a mountain or foresty area, it looks like. So can I string it between two trees? <laughs> what what are you what are your skills, Kimiko? Let's find out. I have many. Uh <laughs> it's <laughs> Just roll me cunning. Okay. So, Hummel, what do you do? So, let me see here. Can we go? Boom, kind of run, run, run out the fucking van and start tying her silk around a tree. Hummel, what do you do? I'll even hear right now. Sonic. Sonic. Uh... Sonic? He said he was having internet issues. That might be what's going on right now. This guy, let me uh, tell you. Well, he's, yeah, he he's said in the, crashing. He's in the turret. I don't know if he, he wouldn't be able to do anything other than, like, dodge. He's trying to shoot you. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Get out of your misery. Take us both out. So, oh, no. your friends have failed to do anything of note, Rue. <laughs> Flower, my beef friend. What do you expect? There's nothing I can do. <laughs> So, <laughs> oh yeah, let me just jump right in front of him and catch him and throw so him off the, the van. Off the the van now. bounces as Suki is slammed off the hood of the shagon wagon. There is a Suki-sized dent, full imprint. This bong as uh, he just slams you on the the, 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 the fucking hood. You take uh, wrestling move damage plus five. Only twenty damage. And then he kind of holds you. He goes, he goes and pulls you up. And he kind of looks towards, kind of looks towards Rue or not towards Rue, towards, towards Kumiko. And he, and he goes, <gasps> rope. And he starts running towards Kumiko with Sugi over his head as he's running towards this rope. Sugi, it is your turn. <laughs> you have um, seven AP. All right. Do I have any hands free? He has, <laughs> he has your anime tank top in one hand on your on your chest, and he's holding onto your leg with the other, like you're like ape hanging you up in the air. Alrighty, thy enemy. Um, okay, I'm not doing that voice. I, I don't have anything for it. <laughs> <laughs> I love your voice, though. <laughs> I'll, I'll do the I'll do the accent, but I can't do the old timey speech. I got you. I got you. It's fine. Bah, this has been fun, but I think it's time you take a seat. And with that, I'm going to uh, place a throne right in front of him as he sits, spikes forward, like as as like as he's in a dead sprint towards Kumiko. I'm going to like just drop a throne right in front of us. Okay. And uh, I'm going to roll out because that takes four AP, and then I will have three AP left. Yeah, yeah. which is not enough for a wrestling move. No, no, no. However, could I acrobatics like out, or is that just like a seer? Uh, it would be acrobatics if you're trying to try roll out. Okay, I just want to like roll out. And then, like, drop on top of him to push him into the spikes as as this thing just, just you know, this, like, eight-foot-tall throne just appears right in front of him. Go ahead. Decorated with horns. Go ahead and roll me that acrobatics check. Use your cunning. Ah, that's pretty high. So, able to, so you kind of, you kind of, like, kind of roll out. And your primrose says, give him the chair, the chair, on your shoulder as you kind of kick him towards that throne. 
the uh, Wario being too fucking fast and going too far, rushing towards Kumiko, cannot avoid the, this giant throne. Uh, he will hit it immediately. Whack! And he will roll away. Uh, I would say five feet away, no problem. As this chair explodes for 6d10 lethal damage. Uh, and yeah, you're out of the way. Especially as Kumiko, oh, are, you, are you out of the way? Yeah, uh, Kumiko, you see this chair get summoned. Roll me a cunning save. Okay. I shatter. Yeah, so you kind of go, fuck, you kind of back up with your rope in your hand as this chair explodes. Mm -hmm. uh, and you will take 32 damage. That's 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay. Um, so the so Wario kind of stumbles, boom, boom, kind of kind of rolls, boom, boom, kind of comes up on, onto his feet in front of Kumiko. He sees her, he goes, ah, and grabs on the Kumiko because you're fully armored. Oh, no. Spider, give me a so Kumiko grappling check using your using your CQB and, and brawn, please. Yep. I did I roll a one? I rolled a natural one. Oh my god. Does it explode? Does it explode? Shut up. <laughs> uh seventeen. Yeah, it explodes. Oh, so, so so Sugi, you kinda you kinda go ha turn around and you see the you see the bear kind of hugging Kumiko. Just so it's like a bear head right 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 in your face, Kumiko, like right here, like kinda go there's a bear snout in your fucking cheek. <laughs> And the bear and Wario goes, I'm having so much fun right now. <laughs> okay. You should pat him on the head. <laughs> Are I'm you just going to hang out and recover my AP until he's done? <laughs> so the bear goes, Do you like bears? <laughs> just still like right, right, right your cheek, Kimiko. Like in what way? <laughs> you know, like for their grace and power in nature. Also, they have, oh, yeah, sure. also, they have very cute ears. They do. They do. You see, okay, good talk. Because he's like big old fucking wet kiss on the cheek and kind of turns around. And he kind of like runs towards Sugi. <laughs> uh, hey. How so, much AP have I recovered while they're just sitting there chatting? I'll say it took about... About 18 seconds of them doing that little thing. So I'll say you recover up to 13 AP. Um... So he's gonna ru rush towards Sugi. He's gonna try and lock in against Sugi. So give me a grappling and brawn as per usual. To see who comes out on top here. Why am I sweating? What the fuck? Yeah. It's so hot right now. Uh, <laughs> grappling and brawn. Do I still have advantage? Uh, negative. I had time to prepare. Okay. Be what? Candy beat? Mm mm. So he goes, he goes, yeah! He kind of wraps you up and he goes, and of course, his face is right in front of yours. He goes, "Your spider lady friend is very cute." He's gonna crush you up, fucking Sugi. Uh, you're gonna take two d twelve again, uh, plus his brawn. I see he's fucking just full on constrictor cracks you up. Now he has you in, in in this grip, and you have one AP. You have one HP left, Sugi. So you're not knocked out yet. What are you gonna choose to do? Tom donated five dollars. Reached word so limit. If Goliath wins, uh, leave yeah. people alone, but will be a potential okay. chance encounter to give the losers a run yeah, back. AP. Magically always having a boon that would be tempting for the um, loser to come back for the rematch till they win. Can I go for a headbutt? <laughs> yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> uh, and, so, and, like, if, if that stuns him, I'm going to roll out. It's like a headbutt and then a roll out. So you can't miss because he's a fucking Goliath right in front of you. Um, I will call it just a punch with your head. You will do one d four plus brawn blunt damage. Give him a 1D4 save. One d four plus brawn. Yeah, give him a, give him a little save here. He's not knocked out, but he will kind of stumble backwards. It kind of, it kind of like release you. Six, nice. Ooh. The most to the threshold. Okay, so he's kind of, he kind of goes, Ugh! kind of holds his head, you know. He's kind of, and you see a little, little bit of blood coming out his cheek and along his eyebrow. What do you do? I'll charge you only two AP for that for that little headbutt. Leaves you with eleven. All 
Fair. Had enough. He goes, no, this is way too much fun. And he kind of smear that blood down his face. Was half, so it was like half dusky ivory and half red. He goes, so, That's so, so, the, so, the, so the, the bear goes, tell you what, if you can't take care of me, I'm going to kiss your lady friend again. You never bring his fucking hands up. How's Sugi looking? One HP. <laughs> Tag me in! Tag me in! I'm, I can do this! Yeah, Anur has been continuously healing Hamel over time. <laughs> Just... <laughs> I don't yeah. built for this big right. like Boru. Okay, so this dude's like at best half health. There's he's, no way he's I can he, get one he, wrestling with him. He, he's, he's he's pretty wobbly though. I can drop another chair on him then fucking die. Set us with a fucking double. I mean, I mean, if, 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 I mean, if you want to summon two chairs, I mean, it's up to you. Because the spell itself says for 10 HP and 4 AP, you can summon a chair style of your choosing. Now, you only have one You, you only have one HP. So it's kind of tricky to, to, try, to try and summon a chair. A little, a little, a little, a little, either, if Rue can sneakily heal you, you might be able to pull it off. But Rue's got to pull a sleight of hand. Magic check. One of my favorite kind and of I checks. Have no wait, sleight of wait, hand. Wait, he's doing he's doing bubbling streams, correct? No. I, I was healing normal with basic healing. Oh, oh okay. So well, if, yeah. if 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 Rook is sticky breaky you a heal without the bear noticing, you could Actually, get the chairs off. I have an idea. What's up? Hey, Kumiko, how are your bee how are your bee stings feeling? She just said BRB. Oh. Uh, in that case, he's going to assume they're not feeling too great, and he's going to cast Bubbling Stream of Healing. That's, uh, oh, does that get Hommel, too? Right does it get the yeah, guy, that... too? Well, no, it oh. only heals allies. How close might it have been? Who says the bear's not an ally? It, it... The fact that he's fighting Sugi? In a non-lethal cage match? <laughs> I mean, we don't know that it's non-lethal. You'll fucking it find out. <laughs> <laughs> it was specifically stated. I can't. Oh, it was specifically the stated that it was non-lethal. Yeah, I don't think I can hit him with. I hit him with only hit him with like the the spiky chair because I, bro is going strong. Uh, well, if you can kind of back off of him and back into the thirty foot radius, then you should be. You should get twenty points of health back right away. Yeah, but as soon as the bear finds out you're healing him, he's, he's going to stop the fight and call Suki a sore loser. No, oh. yeah. tag me in. He goes, no, no taggings. This is me and the king. And he points towards fucking Suki. Right. As it should be. All right. They say Suki evoked the Lord's will to his fault. <laughs> 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 uh would there be any bonuses to start chanting Deus Volt while marching towards him? Is that like an intimidation? Gimme is present. You might get some healing. <laughs> of course, that could cost more issues down the road, but yeah, you get some healing. <laughs> I don't yeah, know that. I don't know if that's worth it. Healing from Skippy? <laughs> Kumiko. Fucking eyes. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Ewee. Of yeah, course, you, know, you, you should be at full health now. Bubbling stream of healing. Of course, you, of course, you do have you know eleven AP up. You could do, two, I think, two. We're on. You can do two wrestling moves, I believe. How much were they? They are six, six, six apiece. Okay, and you said the headbutt was two AP. I'll call it one because you're you're right there next to him. Okay. So you're at twelve. I mean, yeah, they're just like moving my head forward. Yeah, just right. Um, what like what wrestling move would so did I need to do an acrobatic wrestling move for the best chance to hit? I'll say if you can pull off a flying something, I'll, I'll give you an additional D twelve to the 
I'll do the do the damage if you successfully land the attack. Flying chair. <laughs> Pulls out an actual chair, I swear to God. <laughs> I'm going to... Oh, I have an Jump idea. off the van again. <laughs> right? Yeah. And I'm going to do a flying knee strike to his nose. Ah, okay, roll you the hit. You might kill him. This is a guard game, you might kill him. You're just saying words. Shut up. <laughs> I remember. Game. I, ex I explicitly said game. non lethal and I killed a guy. 16 hit? It hits. Alright, and you said an extra d12? Yes, it'll be 3d12 plus brawn. So, slash r 3d12x plus your brawn modifier. There's a dead Oop, dwarf shatters. haunting a dragon wagon. So, roll that shatter for me. Chat saying, "Go, my king! Good lord!" Twenty-nine. <laughs> a flying knee strike to his mm. nose. Okay, so let's see. Hmm. And then I'm gonna do another thing after this, as like I'm. Well, I'm grabbing like the sides of his head and pulling him into a flying knee strike, and I still have that forward momentum. Yeah. Okay, so, so, so kind of, kind of like, again, he kind of goes, and kind of stumbles backwards as his fucking nose shatters. What do you do now? I'm still on his head. Yeah, so, so, so what are you doing? As he's stumbling, I'm going to, um, like, flip him over. So, like, with that, like, with the 200, like, almost 300 pounds of Sugi Hatsfield flying off, in, like, a front flip, hitting him in the knee. I'm going to take his head and like grab it and just use my whole body weight to like throw him backwards as he's stumbling, losing that little bit of footing. Okay. Like drop him onto his, I'll drop him onto his head. So he's stunned. Go ahead and roll me grappling real quick. I'll do his at disadvantage. Because you're currently attached to his head. I'm grappling? No, no, I am. You roll as per normal. Oh, okay. That's just a flat d20. I don't have tap tap or CPD. Can you beat a 15 is a question. Yes, you uh, can. Yeah. Yes, you can. All right. Go ahead and roll your wrestling move damage then. Uh, just the two d twelve. Yeah, I'll call it another three d twelve. Fuck it. So slash r three d twelve x. That's another shatter. Roll it up. Twenty eight. That's just that enough. Is. So 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 as you like turn and kind of send to the ground. The bear that warrior was riding goes and kind of kind of growls in the background, and the warrior goes, "I believe you're right, my friend." He kind of like kind of pats your back. He goes, "You are truly worthy of a boon of Haruti." And as he and the bear kind of actually hugs you, he kind of gives you a shake, and he's kind of like going <laughs> and kind of laughing into your chest, and he's kind of rolling back and forth to. Kubiko and Rue and Hamel, it looks like you're being like strangled and rolled back and forth, but they can't hear him laughing or like congratulating you for, you know, being the most fun he's had in weeks. And he kind of like he's kind of holding Suki on on under his arm, and he goes, eh, "This is the best time I've had in weeks." He kind of stands up. He's got you know Suki under his arm like a fucking bundle of wood. Well, he, why don't you guys come on over? I've got bubbling stream of healing active. You should be able to both heal up. So, you know, they... <laughs> Sugi, did you fight back against the bear holding like that or no? I don't have the physical strength to. That as, took everything I had. It's like, like just nugging you back and forth. Yeah, you're so much fun! You know, kind of give you a little nugget on the way back. It walks I into... Zero yeah. So he walks into the healing radius and he does get healed because it's, it's a non-combative. Uh, well, non-evil combatant. And, uh, you know, they, they start healing up and he goes... Ah. That was good. And he kind of looks towards he kind of looks towards, uh, looks towards Kuka and goes, "It's a shame I can't kiss you again." <laughs> and he just just grinds on fucking Suki's head with this giant fist and a fucking power noogie. Uh, and I'll say it won't do one point of damage because that'd be kind of too funny. Uh, but more, but he kind of sits you down. Ah, he goes, "With a little more training, you could really be a king of the ring." He's gonna hand you. A knuckle duster. And he goes, this is for you. 
in case you might need it again in the future. Thank you, Bear. In return, I have a gift for you. A gift? I'm going to head into the back, and I'm going to grab that half bottle of Jack Daniels. <laughs> or you can get it missed on. He goes, this is a wonderful gift! And he kind of like scoops up Sugi, goes, ah! He's kind of like bear hugging Sugi and turning in circles. You guys see like Sugi's little feet kind of kicking out in this big, big old swing, you know? And he goes, this is a wonderful gift! Wonderful, wonderful! A wonderful gift! And the bear's like, the background, like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? But he, ta he takes the bottle for sure, clink, takes it up, and he slaps down into Sugi's hands, Haruti's reminder. This is a 6d2 exploding tap tack weapon. 6d2? 6d2 exploding, yeah. Oh my god. So in theory, you're going to look Those like D2s this. Those d2s are lethal. So, it, so, so you do like an attack. Is that going to do awesome damage or no damage? As you just beat someone's fucking chest in, you know, just... Go, 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 go. <laughs> That's absurd. I love it. Awesome. I mean, 62 suck, not in a Garbro game. <laughs> so the bear goes, I must be on my way. There are more on the road I must challenge. For the glory of Haruti. Less. And he kind of looks for his Kumiko like... Mm. <laughs> Sorry, he was right. I am more of a dog person. I may find this too hard to bear in my heart. <laughs> I kind of like laughs to, 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 to the air. <laughs> See, he takes rejection gracefully. <laughs> yeah, he didn't get depressed and go off into the woods. So he, to train. So, so, so he kind of pulls off his, his bear, his, 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 like the giant bear helmet on his thing, and because we're in a cloak, he goes, "Yeah." You are pretty, though. He kind of turns around and walks towards this fucking bear down, <laughs> fucking down the road. All right. Uh, Gosh. All right, well, how are we all feeling? I've still got a couple minutes left on this stream of feeling. Oh, yeah. Uh, he's, I, he's here. Doom, doom, I, doom, doom, doom. As the bear kind of walks past the van. <laughs> Just, mm, mm, mm. I'm going to I'm gonna take <laughs> off the mask and the cape. I'm gonna put my pants back on and my LBV. Put my pants back on. <laughs> <laughs> well, better put my pictures back on. <laughs> I have several broken ribs, Rue. Please help me. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay. Ribs broken, arms all bruised up. Like, please. <laughs> Rue will get to work on him, and I would like to specifically say that Rue will stay here with them <laughs> until everybody is fully healed. Well, we're driving, so you'll just yell me as we drive. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I, I just want to say it because it, it bothers me to see that we're all like below full health. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, I'm also going to put up bubbling streams of healing if I can, if it's just a passive thing. Yeah, I got while you. I'm driving. So, and so we're, we're all going to be okay. So, so Kumiko, whatever you're doing, rocks just suddenly fall out of your pocket. Not spaghetti, but rocks. Oh, no. Limbs weak, arms are heavy, fucking spider spaghetti. I don't know. Spider spaghetti. Spider rock sandwiches with peanut butter to use the binder. Spider rock sandwiches. Okay. <laughs> so you guys are here at this point. What's your plan? Are we staying the night here or are we moving forward? Oh. What time of day is it? It's like it's four o'clock. All right. We can we've keep on trucking until we... Sorry, what was that? I was going to say, we've only been on the road for like six hours. Plus that little pit stop back there. Yeah, yeah, let's keep on I don't really know how much nightfall. sleep we got last night. Y'all didn't get shit. <laughs> also, cocaine. Oh, yeah. All of us did cocaine, and it's probably catching up with not, us. Not, 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 not all of you. Three of you did cocaine. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I thought we got massages to remove the fatigue. You got, I know that one of us did. Saying you least. got massages, but you didn't have the cocaine get removed out of your system. How about we continue forward mm -hmm. until we absolutely need to stop? Massage. We'll stop. Massage. So, yeah, like a couple more hours. Or something. So, Subi's going to push on, right? Keep driving. But, Rue, as you look at him, he's been awake for almost almost two days and has gotten the shit beat out of him. 
He's all strung out on cocaine. Or... And has two levels of fatigue. So it's like eye bags on eye bags. Yeah. When, once we stop, he's going to tell Sugi, buddy, you you need to sleep. Don't worry about watch. We'll keep watch. You just get some sleep. Yeah, but then I have to sleep under Kumiko. Woo-woo? Fucking what? <laughs> yeah, what? Uh, if he's standing if he's on he's top of the fucking bed. Clothes. Wait, how much room is in the back? I thought it was like a kitchenette, the bathroom, and then like the, the spot that with the deployable outdoor shower, and then there's just like a bed, and then like a little bit of space around it. So you kind of have to stand on the bed there. Kibiko. Yeah, so so so, so Kubiko is currently lower the bed back there, fucking just... And fucking pretty creepy, yeah, if you don't know, now, if right? don't know her. So do you guys? So do you want to push out? Do you want to push out? Push out until your tank's empty, or what? I was gonna uh, try to stop and get some fuel. Like like refuel. Well, we your... should be at about half. Sorry, go ahead. Saying so you have twelve units left in your tank. You have four more grid squares to go six, until you're nine, empty. 12. We're gonna be yeah, so... we're we're gonna be empty by the next camp, and if they don't have fuel. Then we're kind of boned. Well, that's why we call in the refuel. refuel. We call in yeah, the harpies. We talked about this. We have the harpies that drop the harp yeah. fuel in. I don't know. Yeah, that was available to us from the start. We just haven't made use of it. Well, are they just going to drop off gas cans? Yeah, probably. Uh, then Sounds why like don't we, like that. Why don't we scavenge this place for some food? Because we've only had a peanut butter sandwich in like the past 30 hours. Peanut yeah. bummer. Sure, I can see what I, what I can pick up for us. And. He'll take his grand and I guess go out to see if he can't hunt down a deer or something. Let's see here. Some, whatever the equivalent is. Go ahead and roll me supply and moxie. Supply yeah, and I really moxie. Look, I really want to look for gourds. Gourds. If possible. Uh, gourds. Go ahead go and roll me gourds. <laughs> roll me seer. Or really seer and cunning then. Okay. Why does going out into to the field with nothing but moxie and supply make me think that you're going out like just in like assless chaps and a knife? <laughs> nothing else. Because <laughs> you need to understand that's how I would actually hunt. I like, hope I don't find delicious deer out here. Yeah, I'm the type of guy who will sit up in a tree in nothing but a loincloth and a sharp rock, ready to jump <laughs> down on top of my prey. Me hungry. <laughs> um, oh, gosh. So, Kumiko, you find a single wild gourd. It's not big, it's not mighty, but it will do. The spider girls make you do, don't they? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and Rue, you find, unfortunately, an entire warren of very cute pink rabbits, but they look really meaty. What do you do? <laughs> There are about 12 mm. rabbits there. I'm guessing a lot of babies. I don't want to say the entire family's there, but there are 12 eatable rabbits out of like the 32, so... <laughs> right. They're like well, half I the mean... size of a Flemish giant. Big pink rabbits. Ah, uh, alright. Well, if that's the case, then... Uh, yeah, I don't think Drew would hesitate. He'll try to only take one of them, though. He'll take uh, whichever one looks the oldest, whichever one looks the weakest. That's um, a big guy. You know. So Hummel is a big guy. None of them look weak. None of them look weak. None of them look old. None of them look old. Don't even look... Well, I shouldn't ask if they're sick. I wouldn't, wouldn't want to feed the party sick or uh, tainted meat. It was All like, right, well, it was like, grand in hand, like, he'll take the biggest one you can see. There's like one rabbit... <laughs> <laughs> so you so Sugi and Kumiko and and, and, and and Hamel, you all hear the bang and then a blood curdling scream. These are shrieking rabbits. Saru, give me a brain power save. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know what these were. Brain power save. I hate Garbro games. You have a <laughs> splitting headache. Like, oh, and all the rabbits just knock out. So, 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 so why you go? Oh, was I not able to hit any of them? Well, you, well, you, you got one. Okay. Just knowing your base fucking skill, like you went bang, and the guy shrieked. You went, oh fuck, and got because you got little really sensitive doggy ears, and uh, other ones just scattered. All right. 
he'll pick up his kill and tie it by the ears to his belt loop and I guess go find another bit of prey. Fucking busy buck. Oh no, Make he's sure shooting VTubers. <laughs> oh my god, he shot <laughs> Pippa! <laughs> busy. Oh no, he's shooting VTubers. Uh, I, yes, I am I am eliminating my own kind. I, I am I am racist against my 2D flesh. The, 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 um, the strong must eat the weak. It's a VTuber hunting VTubers. <laughs> Ooh, that'd, that'd actually be a really good concept. I'm not going to lie. Every Jesus YouTuber who Christ. eats other YouTubers, I like that. Uh, like, uh yeah. Well, to find more prey. Supply? No, I know what the V stands for. Don't put that fucking word in my brain. You, <laughs> you find a very panicked pink rabbit all on its own. It's lost its friends. It's breathing really hard, really deep, looking left and right, trying to find somewhere to go. It's confused. What do you do? Uh, you're really about to make me feel bad about this, aren't you? Okay, um, in that case, he'll, uh, pop off his shot and get another one. <laughs> so again, you, so again, you, you just, all y'all hear a bang, rah, this huge scream, uh, Rue, or brain power save. Brain power save. Yep. Yep. Lovely. Fuck. Ooh. So you're, you're, you're like, yeah, he kind of walked towards it, you kind of like, you're kind of walking towards it, and the rabbit's going burr, 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 in your view. And as you reach down to grab the rabbit, you, 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 forward to kind of face, you just kind of lean forward and face plant into the grass. Fucking tail flopped over your fucking head and shit. And you're currently knocked out in the woods. <laughs> Here we go. You find a nice and a gourd. Guard, and a guard bro game. <laughs> and a nice gourd. Nice. Yep. Guard bro game indeed. Very, very, <laughs> very nice gourd. Very nice. Many speckles. Much flesh. Mm-hmm. What is your plan for this goal? Revenge, what? Uh, Why are we so upset about me acting on my biggest instincts? Cody, quick, revenge, save Pippa. (laughs) Save Pippa, I didn't even think about it. No! (laughs) Okay, um... Oh, I didn't even think about it. Oh no, Pippa. Um... I'm going to. I mean, I I wouldn't know anything unless I'm hearing all these screams. Would I know anything about the screams, or am I just gonna head back to camp and be like, "Where's Rue?" What do you do? Great question. I would probably head back to camp and be like, "Where's Rue?" Oh, that's pretty queer. <laughs> Grab Gord while we're at the camp. <laughs> oh goodness. I have to ask, for how long am I going to be knocked out? <laughs> Great question. So, Kubiko, you're oh, back no. at camp. It's uh, so Sugi and uh, so Sugi and Hamel. You two are kind of hanging out, waiting for the suit to get back. If he's not back in a couple hours, I would get suspicious and scared, he's, and probably go look for him. So well, I'm only taking a nap for like thirty minutes, and then I'm gonna yeah, get yeah. That's that's the problem there. You you you. If you could take a nap in your current state, it's gonna be a brain power save at disadvantage. Yeah, thirty minutes is never really for thirty minutes. I, yeah. I would, I would, I don't know, micro sleeps. I, kind of thing? I just closed my eyes. <laughs> All right, brain power disadvantage. I gotta wake up. I gotta drive. Nope. Yeah, twenty though. Yeah, it's it's not, not, not probably fatigue he has, and the, also mm-hmm. the, also the whole cocaine thing, being awake in combat. Mm-hmm. And killing folks. Hummel, what are you doing? Well, it's just sitting in the the um, gun turret, just kind of staring off into space. Hummel, just... did you do cocaine? Yes, I did. Do it. Give me that save. <laughs> That's it, why it, I stared off into space. Hummel. At disadvantage, I'm it, doing Hummel. it. No, okay, now it's got Ooh. me. Do I need so, to draw a picture so, of me hunting so, Pippo with an M1 so 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 you're, 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 you're like, <laughs> okay, you're, you're kind of. So, Kimiko, you don't see a sun out of the top of the dragon wagon. It's almost head hits it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, no. Kimiko, you come back to camp. Hall's asleep. Snoopy's asleep. Moonin's asleep. Fuck it. He's because he also did cocaine. Yeah. So Moonin's asleep. He did a yeah. lot of cocaine. Yeah. He did a lot of cocaine and a lot of killing. So it's like he's harpy. Let's lay out in the grass. Fucking there's fucking Sue. He just almost just. Mm-hmm. What do you do? Okay. Um. 
Well, they're sleeping, so I'm going to let them sleep. I'm back. I'm going to get started on some food. But if in a couple hours, like like an hour and a half or two hours, if Rue's not back, I'm going to set the gourd to steam or whatever and then try and go out to find him. Set your gourd to steam. <laughs> what else am I supposed to do? What is it called? I don't know. <laughs> makes me sad. Uh... Give me a cooking and brewing chicken brain power as you set your gourd to steam. <laughs> uh, for context, I'm trying to make the sweet gourd it's, it's, hot it's, it's, dish. What I figured, yeah. Yeah. Sweet gourd. A thousand bad guys with swords. Not my best, not my worst. 3.5 Runkin. Not great, not terrible. Is hot it dish hits the DC. Is hot dish one word or two words? DC twenty one. Twenty one. A uh, sweet gourd hot dish is four words. Okay, so hot dish. Yeah. Dish is in your area. DC twenty one. <laughs> so you have set your gourd to steam. Yeah. And you're sitting there. You're like, okay, it's an hour passes, and okay, it's kind of weird. Oh, baby. Oh, oh, look at it. Buddy. Love you. It's on, by the way. Oh, thank you, baby girl. Appreciate you. But uh, you know, hour passes by, Kumiko, and uh, nothing happens. Two hours pass by, nothing happens. Rue, as Dude, the third, tough. as the third hour passes by, you kind of uh, you wake up, and but you realize you can't move your arms, or your legs, or your body. You can move your eyeballs around and look around. Are you tracking? All right. <laughs> yeah, I'm tracking. Uh, he's going no, to start no, no, off no, no, no. trying to... Not, not done no, yet. No, 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 just not done hear yet. me out. Just... Oh, you're not done yet? Okay. Not done yet. Is there a deer you hear, his butt? You hear a growl in the woods around you. But as you're kind of looking around, mm. you can't see what's growling at you. Give me perception and brain power. Perception and brain power. Plus 15 to the roll. You... Okay. Breathe in deep with your little fidgeting null nose. And you realize with horror that there is a Dan Dwa around you, which is a timber wolf size Dwa, which is basically a, a wolf in, in, in this world. Okay. And you were ass up in the fucking air. Okay. Can I start so, by yeah. trying very slightly to just barely twitch the tips of my fingers. Give me a grit save. DC 45. Jesus Christ. Okay, I thought I'd be able to take the... I can't I can't pass that, but I'll do it anyway. So, um, now, so now it's 40, because you failed one. So you're like, you're looking around, and you hear the... around you as this Dandwa is stalking you. Kubiko, what do you do? You're at camp. I was I was gonna go look for him after the first like two hours, maybe two ish hours. How? I kind of just try and see, like, go into the woods, look for hunting trails, kind of like see what he would have seen. Mm -hmm. If I see his footprints, I'll follow them. The, the Noel's footprints in the forest. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, do you have tracking? No. God. You investigation. Investigation. Now. Oh, you know what? Sure. Investigation and cunning. Okay. As you, hmm. <laughs> you, after an hour, find the blood splutter of of, of, of of the first pink rabbit, the first shrieking rabbit. And you're like, okay. okay. You kind of look around, and you kind of it's see kind of like a bullet casing. Oh well, yeah, you, you 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 see where he's kind of gone from the forest. Like, all right, you got to head in that direction. Rue, mm -hmm. give me another grit save, DC forty. Okay. All righty. DC thirty five now. Okay. You hear can some? I... Good. Oh, Go ahead. Can I, using my eyes to my B, try and point it back in the direction of the camp to like? Kind of nudge it off in that direction. Go get help. This fucking bee goes. This is kind of tilts to the side. 
it, it, you're high in, in like thinking to himself, you're supposed to be high intelligence. Come on, help me out here. <laughs> kind of like going back and forth from your face. And then you hear and feel something sniffing around you and sniffing your tail. Is it like his toes? Guard, I swear to God, if this fucking wolf mounts me, I'm going to be so <laughs> upset. <laughs> I swear to actual <laughs> God with a capital G, Drew. I'm going Drew. to be so upset. <laughs> Drew, I think I think you're clear because this said there, there's there's none of that. It's stated clearly in the CC manual. Okay. Yep. Okay. It's very clearly stated in the CC manual. I understand also, that. Would never but ever beat the allegations. Guard would never beat <laughs> the allegations. I I would understand mm -hmm. it because it would be really fucking funny. But, but also, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> so <laughs> Bacon says don't swear to get don't swear to him swear to guard <laughs> <laughs> is, I get an item is the wolf a lady or male okay so I was gonna wait for this to happen so I'm gonna go ahead and do it secretly all right because I don't want even chat to know this I'm gonna okay. use I'm gonna use the fucking thorny pain dice for this <laughs> the pain boys <laughs> oh god if it's a, at least, at least I guess getting mounted by a woman wolf isn't as bad as getting mounted by a man wolf. <clears throat> yeah, but the issue but comes up is totally whether not it's ever like happened in this game, Yagard. <laughs> <laughs> so, Rue, what is Did one to two? Pseudo penis. Th then the issue comes up as to whether it's got that female hyena pseudo penis. Rue, what um, what what gender is one to two? I'm sorry, could you refer? I, I didn't understand the question. What gender of the wolf is one the two, male or female? Um, okay. Male on two, female on one. Okay. So, Rue, you're like, you feel your heart in your chest beating. And you feel something sniff. Heavily at your tail, kind of snuffing around. It's, it's, and wherever this is, this this fucking dandwa starts licking and grooming your tail behind you. You can feel it licking up your tail and kind of like more or less grooming you in a way. But you can't see it. You can only hear it, and that's it. And your 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 chest, is, your fucking chest is beating heavily. Um, Kimiko, give me another investigation and fucking grit real quick. And grit. No, sorry, uh, great, sorry, uh, uh, cunning. Cunning? Yeah. Okay. Okay, that's, that's good. <laughs> that's good. Yeah. So, so, come you're, like, you're like, like, okay. Because you hear, because you hear, like, this, like, high-pitched whine through the force, which is Rue going, mm, fucking, it's, trying to make any kind of noise he can. Just, ah, it's this high-pitched throat whine, because he can't do anything else. And you're <laughs> going, can you kind of, through the forest. Now, Rue, you feel this this fucking dandwa jerk your pants down and start licking and, and kind of like grooming up and down your fucking thighs. You're wearing underwear, I assume, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I am. So you oh, no. feel something licking up and down your thighs and kind of still kind of like snuffling and grooming. And, 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 you know how dogs would like the jack, 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 kind of groom thing? It's doing that to your bite. thighs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, but yeah, not yeah. So. yeah. Now, Kubiko, you burst out of the tree line to see this elderly female wolf just grooming fucking Rue in the middle of this little clearing. <laughs> so what I'm hearing like is there's a milf wolf cleaning me right now. What the fuck? <laughs> it's not a bad day. <laughs> not a bad day! <laughs> well, think about it. You're all smelly, but in combat, she's like, oh, this, this fucking thing's dirty. I gotta clean this fucking thing. Wolf fuck is gross. I mean, I guess smells like male. I don't know. <laughs> a dirty mail okay, she's, clean. she's gonna she's gonna start like gently cussing in um god i forget what the language for Havader is called script she's gonna start start uh gently cussing and just shooing her away trying to be gentle get off of him <laughs> so so this old oh, this old demo goes and kind of like kind of kind of rouse up in kumiko uh rude give me another grit save DC 30. Oh, well, dude, it just gets worse. 
<laughs> <It's> <laughs> <It's so bad. laughs> Heads up, fox, big boy coming. Oh, a mule potion. Hold on. <laughs> Silence. Underscore, underscore green has activated a mule potion. Hold on. Mule. It just keeps the getting mad worse. Dwarven mule. The mad dwarven god calls his pet off. Okay. So. <laughs> so the wolf kind of goes rawr rawr. He kind of like. It, the, the the old the old dandwall kind of, kind, of, kind of goes rawr, 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 at Kumiko in a very sarcastic, huskyish way, you know. Kumiko, mm -hmm. what do you do? It's just gonna she's gonna like m match kind of like a protective posture, kind of. She's gonna try <laughs> the pose and like just like try and try and like gently <laughs> scoop him up, maybe. Kumiko, give me <laughs> give me bluff and fucking moxie. Okay. No, no, intimidate, intimidate, and Moxie. There we go. Intimidate. Okay. Where the fuck is my? Oh, there it is. Nice. <laughs> so, the old Dandwa goes and kind of chuffs at you, grabs Rue's pants and kind of drags them off of him. And so, but the old, old Dandwa grabs Rue's pants, drags them off of him, and then just walks walks into the fucking woods, just in, 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 in the trees. She just shakes her head and goes, I am so sorry, and just puts you on her back. Rue, grit safe. Do you have to grab the other the other rabbit that's lying on the ground? Did the dwarf eat it? Do I see? <laughs> you just keep failing, Jesus. You see his rifle yeah. <laughs> and the pink rabbit, Rue. Or, uh, 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 yeah. I'll, I'll pick up anything that looks like he might have, you know, had something to do with it. Yeah, it's, it's pretty obvious that he killed the rabbit and passed out. Both rabbits, because one's still tied to his fucking waistband. Yeah. yeah. Just, just watch. Actually, the... if one was tied to his waistband, does the wolf have it now? <laughs> is the yeah, dead that's one? what I was thinking. Oh. <laughs> it does. It took the rabbit. She took with his him. pants. <laughs> yeah. Maybe that's why she wanted them. I mean, hey, whatever, right? It's one rabbit. So, Kimiko, you pick up Rue. You start kind of carrying him towards camp. <laughs> Rue, give me another grit save. <laughs> yeah, sure thing. <laughs> you guys are threading through the force after an hour. Rue, give me the grid safe. DC 30, man. DC 20. I'm, I'm keeping track. It's going down. Okay, okay. Yeah. All right, fair enough. You just, you just, you just, keep, you just, keep, you just keep failing, <laughs> failing to make it. Yeah. So, 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 you know, an hour passes. Another grid save, please. All right. Yeah. Yep, yep. Sorry, I was looking at uh, chat for a second. Another 14, failure. Not terrible. Not great, but not so terrible. Kumiko, you have an entirely paralyzed rune in your arms. What do you do, if anything? She's I... just gonna try and chat to keep him entertained, like about nothing in particular. Like just <laughs> this. Beast... I have this fucking gourd shit on at home. I hope it's not fucking oversteamed. Should I go get a You see this fucking bee going dash something, or just drink water between like rune and fucking also, Kumiko? Like what the nice fuck is this normal? The kids not being abused by wild animals. <laughs> The, the seems to be there normal. <laughs> if if bees could look concerned, it looks concerned. Just looking at Rue. Yeah. Uh, this is lovely. Note to self: never kill the pink rabbits again. Okay. Uh, you see, Does right? every prey animal in this world have that that kind of fucking thing on them where it's like, oh well, you kill them, but you Rue, get, you get knocked the fuck out. <laughs> Rue, you you failed every single DC so far. As yeah, Kumiko emerges from the forest, just beat a DC 10. <laughs> what you gotta do? <laughs> God fucking damn it. <laughs> DC 5, Rue. She... <laughs> Kumiko sets you down. For one. <laughs> Un fucking oh believable. That's the funniest shit I've ever seen. So, come up, so Rue, you're, you're you're fucking this. You are completely lucid and knock the fuck out. You were just, you are you are toast, my guy. <laughs> oh my so, god! So, Rue, uh. the most noise you can make is uh, 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 and move your eyes. That's all you can do. Well, in that case, he's just gonna lay there until he gets his faculties back. He's ready to go hunting again once he's ready to go. I guess. Stoogie, Hummel. Fucking brain power saves. <laughs> <laughs> Living is pain. She's she's fucking tired too. Okay. Hamel and Sugi do wake up. That would have been like four 
four or five hours since they went out fucking doing shit. As well as mm -hmm. go cooking. So you guys are so you guys hear the the uh, steady tick 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 of fucking Kimiko's legs. Hamal, you kind of look around and you see Rue just like in fucking Kimiko's arms. He ah, tried to lean him ah. in a comfortable position. Yeah, so no left, leave it like the Peter Griffin, like the Peter Griffin when he falls. Oh, <laughs> so Hamal, yeah, try to do something nice for the party, and this shit happens. <laughs> <laughs> You're just looking at the wolfless oh, female, all right? Let's prepare here, because I was full prepared to yeah. fuck you over, literally. <laughs> it is, yeah. no. it is nine o'clock at this point. It yeah, is it is dark. It, it, it is night time. <laughs> what? Mm -hmm. uh, oh, do note that his pants uh, are gone. <laughs> Both of you will notice that immediately. Are you okay? Oh, he almost says as he falls out of the. Fur's all fucked up in a cow lick, so his fucking thighs and shit. Around his butt. Whoa. Yeah. What, if oh, looks what, could oh. kill. <laughs> um, just, just can't move your mouth. Just, ah. Sugi, Sugi, um, Ryu's not to reply. What? Yes, um, yes. What did Kumuko do to him in the woods? Oh, uh, what, what did Kumuko do to him in the woods? What did Kumuko do to you, Ryu? Did she break your back? Did she break it through? Ooh, oh. I don't know if this <laughs> Fucking, you're fucking Kumuko baning fucking Ryu. I get out of the dragon like I crawl out of the turret and just hop down on the other side. I crawl I walk over to Rue. Did she uh did she, did she break your back? Did she knock the back out of whatever the saying is the humans have? <laughs> did she blow your back out, Rue? <laughs> did she blow your back out the room? <laughs> Rue, give me your best <laughs> I'm, I'm paralyzed <laughs> noises towards Hommel if you don't mind. <laughs> He's not making noise. He's just looking Hummel dead in the eye. He's looking him in the eye. Oh, as if to say, I could have let you die to that lightning bolt. You know what? <laughs> you know what's moving? I, you know, <laughs> Suki, he's not moving at all. He's just giving me a death stare. I, I, Kumuku, what the fuck did you do to him? I found him like this. He was gone for hours. What? <laughs> Oh, oh, actually, that's, like, not good. Oh, actually, so uh, Rue will smell like, like, fucking wolf spit, just so you're aware. Like, it's completely rank Bro, smelling. Is, do we know what that smells like? You guys don't know what that smells like? It's a common knowledge? To me, no. it is, though. I'm a, well, I'm a city person. Okay, Rue, normally you smell like dog, but you smell like bad dog. Like, like dog uh, dog. Like, <laughs> you've been <laughs> a bad boy, Rue. You smell like wild mutt right now, Rue. You know what? I know what you need. Kumuko, uh, oh yeah, you can't come over here. Kumuko, drag him over here. I got him, I got him. I pick Rue up. <laughs> and make sure his butt's facing Hold forward. On. <laughs> <laughs> Just a cow-licked ass fur. <laughs> <laughs> so, Kumuko, uh, you check on your gourd. The gourd is perfectly steamed. Good to go. No problem there. <laughs> okay. You've and, also got a whole rabbit. Now yeah, too. a whole ass rabbit. <laughs> yeah, I'll I'll prepare that to go with it, but uh, first she's well, she's gonna like skin the rabbit, and then she's gonna uh, try and tend to Rue until he regains his <laughs> limbs. So this rabbit fur, by the way, is extremely soft, like cottony, silky soft. Mm -hmm. And the meat itself is also pink. Oh, that's not unusual for meat. Just not unusual. Well, it's like bright. But pink. is it bright pink when it's cooked? We'll, we'll find out. Uh, Kimiko, go ahead and give me yeah. your cooking and brewing check and your brain power. Now, Hummel, you are, you are presenting Rue's cowlicked ass to the fucking world. What, what, what are you doing? I am wearing underwear, thank you very much. So, Kimiko has ruined the rabbit. I fucked it. <laughs> Just, <laughs> it's on fire. Let me go fucking fire. Fire pillar. Rue, the rabbit's on fire. Rue, your rabbit. I'm so sorry. The anus eyebrows. I drop Rue and run to the burning rabbit. I'm gonna. I'm gonna drop the burning rabbit and run to Rue. I'm gonna. Do a little switcheroo there. I'm gonna open up the the cabinet because I need like smelling salts or something to wake this boy up. So there is inside the cabinet a single syringe. Uh -oh. What's in it? You have no idea. 
You were okay. At the very least, Rue is a white feather, so if it's an unknown drug, he should have some level of tolerance. So we'll Rue, see. you're you're currently fucking gangle fucked on the ground. You you will take damage from him being dropped, but from just dumped by fucking Hommel, uh, you will take seven points of blunt damage. I'm going to kick you so hard in the balls. I swear to God. So like Kumoko, if if Sugi tries to approach with the fucking syringe, she's just. Face in boobs, she's just holding him to her chest, like no, 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 get away from him with that. Almost mourning the rabbit. <laughs> hey. <What? laughs> hey, hey, Kimiko, just let's just lay him down on the bed so we can rest, and then we can go get some food or something. I'll scan him around in here. Uh, so oh, okay. when, oh, oh, when oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, Rue, Rue. Yeah. From you, I need a grit save at an unknown DC. I can't tell you, okay? Almost humming a song about dead rabbits. So he has are a you, plus three are to you that. one short, or just DC 16. He has a, I can, if I use Songbird, I can give him a Does plus three. Does the dice god seem to, seem to enjoy so, this tonight? Um, so, Kumiko, Sugi, you two are arguing. You hear a wet pitter patter on the grass below you. Is he peeing? He's peeing. She'll, she'll ask that to Suki. She's like, is he peeing? <laughs> he's, uh, is he she's, peeing? she's not looking down. She's just like, uh, I already know. Yeah, he's definitely pissing. It's in between your legs, though. No, is... no, because she's hugging him to her chest. So he's going to be pissing all down her fucking stomach. <laughs> um, just a nice warm stream. Like, he's peeing. <laughs> he's peeing, isn't he? Like, mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. All down your shirt. <laughs> Fucking apron. Oh no! <laughs> here, here, Kimiko. Let me let me take him from you. And there's a shower hooked up to the bag. <laughs> okay. That's too far. It was just, just DC sixteen, down bro. And... Come on. It was DC five, and you still failed, Ru. <laughs> no, 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 don't, yeah. don't, don't, don't lay him down on the bed. He's he has piss he hands. He... Okay. Oh man! Oh man! Our, our fucking nose all pissy. Damn it, man! Don't put one to piss. Well... <laughs> all right. Um. I'm going to take the syringe, and I'm just going to get him in the ass with it while Kumiko's taking a quick shower. <laughs> you bastard. Yeah! I say, Paul so... is humming a funeral song, Paul, and I'm going to use Songbird. I'm going to use Songbird. I'm not so he has a plus, plus, he has a plus three to grit. You're just going to roll Rude us? I... You're singing the rabbit of fucking deaths. <laughs> you know what? So no, no, you, did, you know what? Know what? Real quick, Hummel. What do you sing? Uh, I sing a, a, an old Goliath like funeral song. Crazy, what is it? Uh, <laughs> oh God! Uh, Not so funny, angel. meow, is it? Huh? In the arms of an angel. You're just in the arms of the <laughs> angel. Fly away <laughs> with the fucking burnt ass crispy ass rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you so you so you jab ruin the ass. Rue, you feel hot, blinding pain just arc out from your butt cheek. Um, you still can't move, but you're in pure, utter agony as this medicine starts relighting your nerves. Problem is, you can't scream, but you can still pee. <laughs> so, so the His only... His empty now, I thought. He's just like... Just... He's a dog. He's always got more. And this, and his little bee goes... Kind of goes... And goes Kind of pats Ruse with his like little, 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 little bee hand. Kind of pats his face, going, "It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay, little guy." <laughs> uh, and yeah, so Sugi, you jabbed him. It's gonna take roughly twenty minutes to re to relight Ruse's nervous system. Uh, Kumiko, are you showering? All the fucking null piss off yeah. you. Yeah. Now he yeah. now he is a white feather, so this pee smells really fucking weird. <laughs> so it's because it's a white feather yeah. pee. <laughs> Like asparagus uh, piss. Yeah, it yeah. Starts, I start humming unravel as I as I bury the the food, the Tokyo Ghoul opening. Um, <laughs> oh god! You're seeing unravel. I... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is dead, ruined, burnt fucking rabbit. You're singing unravel as you put on the ground. Uh. I want to say that af after Kumoko's done showering the null piss off of herself, 
<laughs> She's gonna get like some cloths or something and try and have, wash off Rue. Uh, I'm just hanging out with Rue. Like I got my arm around, I got my arm around his shoulder while he's just sitting there covered in piss. This is a She's just Drag fully on. unaware of what the, what's just taken place. She's just got the cloths and she's like, no. "Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. We might have to take his underwear can we, off." Can we, can we go? He'll be he'll be fine in a minute. He'll he can, he can, he can so, take his own shower. So so so, 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 so Sugi, a, a, a minute passes. <laughs> nothing happens. So we're after boarding this rabbit, still seeing unravel. It so just looks at Sugi. You see, like, I mean, Rue just. <laughs> and Sugi's arm. Rue! Rue! Yeah, it's I'm been a minute. To... I'm just gonna. <laughs> She's just gonna start trying to clean him up. Rue? Rue I want Rue, you to know that you're my you friend. I don't know why you're still trying to talk to him. He's not able to speak. <laughs> Rue, eyes, I'm getting eyes. I'm getting texts and you can't scream but you can pee the joys of DMing <laughs> Rue, Rue, eyes oh god Rue, uh, eyes up and down for yes eyes left and right for no nightmare 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 Rue, nod your eyes left or no, like left and right for no, up and down for yes, if you want Kumiko to wipe up your piss. <laughs> Instead of sitting there waiting a bit for you. I'm to not going to let him just sit in it. Just stew in his own pee. <laughs> so it's, 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 it's just Rue, unconscious, like, well, he's uh, unwieldy, cowlick fur, pissy fur. Eh. <laughs> it's in, uh, uh. This little B on Facebook. It's gonna be okay. Relax. <laughs> he's not gonna react much. He's just gonna look at you, Sugi, and can he piss and morse? Make motions as if he's <laughs> sighing. Quick, and quick, Rue. Piss, just... piss and morse code. <laughs> <laughs> piss and morse code. Oh, God. Can I try to make one more grit save? <laughs> See if I can't make this work. Sure. Please. Just, uh, just please. I, I want this to be over. Just beat a sixteen, he's singing, bro. So he's got a bonus, can, right? Can he get it? Yeah. Oh, there, so there's now a singing. bonus to his grit, so he's got songbird going. So just, you gotta beat a sixteen, brother. What's the bonus of songbird? Plus three, plus three, three, three right? fifteen. Wait, one shy again. He, he has some nerves relit because it's been like at least fifteen minutes. It's been what, five what minutes. It's been five fucking minutes. That's that's a quick ass shower from Kuma, bro. Just spraying down fucking no pee. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah. Rue have All arc right. mind break. <laughs> Rue pisses dot d d d d dot dot d d d dot. Okay, so it's been <laughs> ten minutes out of the twenty required for his things to get re 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 reignited. So, what's <laughs> heads up, what's chuckle you? fucks? Hold Big on, boy, coming through. <laughs> Okay, she's gonna she's gonna yep. pull Rue's face to look her in the <laughs> eyes. Cody says, "Fuck it, get this scene over with." <laughs> <laughs> you know what, Rue? I don't even blame you, Cody. You honestly, know, you know what, Rue? Your Rue, your nerves are back. <laughs> I just uh, finish uh, up. Uh, auto pass the grid. <laughs> 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 I just started Here, let me roll it one more time just see what happens I, I'm seeing the fire force opening <laughs> negative one again oh my god Rue what the Seven. fuck <laughs> you auto pass the great save you, you, you Cody make okay. it stop <laughs> uh, my head yeah, hurts you, you just hear simultaneously as Rue's jaw clicks to one side <laughs> ah, and to the other ah. I'm going to go hunt a rabbit and a wolf and he's going to grab his garand from Kumiko, take like some wadding from his pack, and stuff it into his ears. <laughs> and he's gonna go hunting again, <laughs> pantsless. He's actually going to strip off his shirt too. He's going to go le hunting. leave the bee bucket. We're going out. <laughs> yep, let's do this naked, motherfuckers. 
So you, so, you, so all of you watch Rue just fucking take off all of his clothes, except for his hat and his fucking rifle. <laughs> I'm singing There Goes Our Hero. Um, there um, goes my hero. Watch him as he goes. <laughs> uh, Commander? Clear? Clear? Um, C- Commander? What are you doing? <laughs> Peter, why are you stripping naked and going out of the woods? Hey, yo, boss, why the Don't fuck you questions. naked? Don't I'm at least going questions. with you this I time. I want my pants back. I'm at least going with you this time, she says, and she'll pack up some of her stuff. I just want my pants back. <laughs> I don't even care about the rabbit. I'm just gonna, I just want my fucking pants back. <laughs> Due to the fact... I'm not I... leaving it like a bra in a man's room. <laughs> That's the walk of shame. <laughs> Due to the fact you're covered in your own piss, uh, and also you stink from medical solution, uh, you do not find that fucking wolf. No matter, <laughs> uh, I'll say after an hour of you trying to find this fucking she wolf, you don't find her. You find more pink rabbits though. If you want to take care of that problem, problem. Do do I at least find scraps of my pants? <laughs> no, she took your pants with her. I'll your make, pants are I'll make pants are new off. Pants. No, it's all right, Kumiko. I think I have a spare pair. It was just about the principle of the thing. It's about the the, mm-hmm. the, the pantable of the thing, you know? Yeah. And he'll kind of walk back to camp with the earplugs still in. Do you want any more rabbits? Because 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 you'll find rabbits. Do well, you want to shoot some rabbits or no? Now you got your yeah. too. Well, I know if the earplugs will actually help me or if the scream goes through the earplugs somehow. We'll find out. Dude, please, both okay. of you get knocked out. Please. <laughs> please. Getting as close to camp as Mico possible. Balls on him. <laughs> no! Oh, no. Oh, suffocated. This is how Rue dies. Getting as close to camp as possible, and as far away from his prey as possible, with earplugs screwed in nice and tight, he's going to tell Kumiko to do the same. Okay, <laughs> stuff webbing in my ears. He's gonna take a shot off at this rabbit as far away as he can. I'm talking full 200 <laughs> feet on that grand. Okay, now at 200 feet, go ahead and roll the hit real quick. <laughs> All right. Don't you guys love Garbro games? <laughs> Aim shot. You're the best. You're the best. <laughs> All right. This this is a rather chaotic session. 22. So you hit. You kill the rabbit. It screams. Your earplugs work. All right. He's going to go in, scoop up that fucking rabbit, and drag it back to the camp. Still, just a cap, a rifle, and nothing else of the fucking rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, go, do you want to try and cook that rabbit? <laughs> you, I'm going to prepare it away from the fire. You, you, you've had quite a show. And then Mind move you, it just, just with Rue's fucking white feather butt cheeks, <laughs> just, just walking around the fucking forest in front of you. <laughs> She's like this permanently the whole time, and then she catches herself staring. And she goes, ah. <laughs> She just fucking shakes herself out of it. Okay, okay, I'm focused. If you weren't covered in pee, it'd be so turned on right now. <laughs> As she's cooking, Rue would hop into the, the portable shower and get the piss off of him and change into his spare clothes. <laughs> go give me a cooking, go cooking chip. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting DMs guard why he's so mean. <laughs> uh, great question, guys. I don't know. There you go. I cooked the rabbit. You cooked Yay. the rabbit. Okay. <laughs> this rabbit counts as the... so. This so each serving of rabbit counts as three rations. Okay. How many servings okay. did we get? You have six servings. Just one. Six servings. Mm-hmm. Perfect. All right. Uh, that actually works out great. Because I would really love if tonight three people consumed two of the portions of hot gourd dish out of the six. Hot gourd! <laughs> yeah, because it once you consume two of the hot gourd dish servings, it puts you to sleep within an hour. But it has great benefits. I have to drive. Yeah, but we're sleeping right now. We we're know, for the night. You know, this we gourd could come in handy for fucking Rue. <laughs> the entire time. 
Yeah, could have. Go and tell Ru. Nah, Ru's keeping an eye out for more rabbits. So <laughs> he's keeping an eye out for rabbits on the tree so, line. So Kumiko, tell Ru what the fucking Gord Hot Dish does. So if you consume two servings, you sleep for an hour, and then you wake up the next morning, all of your DCs are negative six to what they would be. Lowered by six. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that yeah, angry, I yeah? That. Yeah? You don't do for. <laughs> yeah, I suppose I can go for that. I'm a little bit hungry. Yeah. And thirsty. I have no more pee left. <laughs> I'm making piss. You can't talk right now. I'm making piss. <laughs> and while he's eating, he'll find a flower and feed it to his bee. The bee kind of lands on your hand, Rude, and kind of goes, and looks up at you. And see the, the bee... You know what it says? I'm so sorry this happened to you. I had no idea. You, you, just, you just know innately is what this bee is saying to you. <laughs> I'll give it a little nod. <laughs> but the bee goes, oh. bzz, 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 bzz. it kind of, it kind of walks over. It kind of dips its fucking hands. It's a little. Do bee have hands? Bee feet? What? It, it's a little bee feet. Bee feet, more like bee. Yeah. It, it finds some of the gravy from Kumiko's rabbit and hot gourd dish, and she, and it kind of stamps out a message. And on the uh, <coughs> on your little uh, mess kit in front of you, the message says, "Don't worry, at least it was female." Thank God. Yeah, that doesn't help there, buddy. I, I'm still out of pair of pants. Thankfully, I had a spare, but yeah, you know. The, the bee kind of like nice to keep that other rabbit. The, the bee, bee kind of goes bzz, bzz, and kind of hopping bzz, 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 back up to the gravy, bzz, 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 back over. It goes, puts the message out, and it says. It could have been a male. Dot, 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 dot. <laughs> yeah, it certainly could have been worse. And <laughs> he'll keep on eating his food. He, he's keeping an eye out for pink rabbits, however. He will tell the party, yeah, don't kill the pink rabbits. They scream. Um, don't yeah, don't do that. Hommel, you see a whole pack in your fucking 50 cal. What do you do? It's the most out of Heard of rabbits. I could do the. I have a chance to do the funniest thing ever, but I'm not going to do it. What? What? Do what? <laughs> Shoot all the rabbits with the gun. I'm not going to do that though. Mm -hmm. uh, but no. So yeah, find them first. Yeah. Because <laughs> he goes. Tom goes in the woods. All right. Hope there are any sexy milf wolves in these woods. Falls over. Oh no. <laughs> I've fallen <laughs> down and I can't get up. Hope no one bathes me with their. <laughs> Jesus why why do I get knuckle dusters and Rue gets molested? <laughs> oh. Yeah, I don't know either. We'll see what happens, though. Why do I get knuckle dusters and Rue gets molested? <laughs> I, 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 all I do is try to be helpful. I try to be, I, I try to keep pretty healthy. I try to be smart. And then I get molested by a wolf. I love that. That That is a great fucking sentence, Sugi. Holy shit. Why do I get knuckle dusters and Rue gets molested? <laughs> Can that be a shirt? <laughs> <laughs> Brought to you by the All Skeleton Party. <laughs> oh, so someone, you know, someone clip that. <laughs> oh my you head know, hurts. You know, uh, oh. We we should we should make that just like the title of this episode. <laughs> Why did I get knuckle dusters? <laughs> Why did I get knuckle dusters and Rue gets molested? <laughs> <laughs> That's my title for the session. Right. I would like to. Uh, let me see. I think could. Unless no, but unless somebody has a differing opinion to this, I would prefer if Ru, uh, Sugi, and Kumoko were the ones that ate the two servings of the uh, the hot dish, hot hot gourd dish. What thing. gourd? My hot gourd. What gourd? Why doesn't Hamlet get any? Because yeah. there's only six servings, and if, up, if three Fox, people want to consume two, through. you know, six divided by two Tom is three. You know why Hommel doesn't get it. What does it do again? Be dominated to secure it. It. In the path, another future enemy. What the hell did Tom do? What did he do? An alpha male wolf will find the pants, smell them, and remember Rue as a rival canine who needs to be dominated to secure standing in the pack at another future enemy. <laughs> I thought we said there was going to be no that stuff he in this never game. agreed to that. It's fine. It's, it's fine. in the CC. I'm down game. to kill a male wolf. I, I, I'm down to kill a wolf. I'm down it's for just, it. So it's just go. Rue with double 50s mowing down a fucking wolf. <laughs> 
I, I am going to sleep with my fell right next to me the entire night, <laughs> okay. sitting up in that fucking shower, backed up into the shower so that it can only come in at one angle. It's it's an outside <laughs> shower, however, there is a toilet. Heads up, chuckle fuck. Okay, I'll do that. Coming through. Anywhere just... where I can have just Cody one angle of attack towards me, potion. and I can just I'm impatient. No <laughs> more encounters or attacks until the, the party reaches <laughs> okay. Choke point the fucking wolf. I got you, Cody. So, I'm gonna sleep in the bed. Bruce sleeping on the fucking toilet. <laughs> what, the wow. what does the hot dish do again? <laughs> it's just Moonin's probably sleeping in a bush. The hot dish. So the, the hot the, dish. Your DC by six. If you can. Yeah, if you consume two servings, it decreases all DCs for the next six hours once you wake up by six. Oh, damn. If you only consume one serving, it gives you the racked out effect for 12 hours. But oh. we only have six servings. That's fine. Okay, Hummel's let the fucking wolf come at me. Let the Hummel's... fucking wolf come at me. Let's fucking go. Bring my pants <laughs> back, bitch. Hummel's just gonna <laughs> scope out, just sit on, sit with the 50s, just staring out into space. <laughs> While you guys I sleep. hope you fully understand, you noble game master. This game is going to be proof. There is now fighting it now. <laughs> He's taking this personally. <laughs> yeah. Can, uh, can here? I got a proposal. Can Kumiko make a simple, like, little hammock that she can put up on treetops? Absolutely. I will allow the automatic. <laughs> okay. And she'll say, "Rue, do you want to?" Go somewhere the wolf can't get you. You hear his jaw click, and he goes, "You know what? No, no, I don't. I want this wolf to come back. I want it to bring me my fucking pants. I'm going to skin it and wear it like a coat." Bro, I want you to know. What are you talking about? This wolf? We like it does no like what? What wolf? <laughs> do, huh. do we have Jenna? beef with this with the female wolf, or do you have beef with another? I wolf? do. You go to sleep, Hummel. Before <laughs> oh, okay. I kick you in the balls for making fun of me while I was passed out. To make it fun of you. I was having fun. You all would do the same with me. Uh, I hate this game. I want to. I want to try one thing. What's She's that? gonna look at him. Go, Rue. Wink, like very, very distinctive wink. Do you want to go somewhere nobody can see you? He hasn't showered. He did shower. <laughs> brain power to see if he picks up on this. <laughs> no, he doesn't. <laughs> Rue, what? Dude, what? Gypsy he is wish you dead piss set on killing this here, fucking dude. wolf. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> he is dead set on killing this fucking wolf. He is sitting on top of the shagging wagon, waiting for a wolf to show up, and he's got his fall out, ready to go. Just full I on. I am so <laughs> sorry, my guy. Just, just full he's metal. Just, just, just full right metal now. jacket on the fucking toilet. <laughs> 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 I want to say, if you ate the two six, servings two, of the hot dish, full metal jacket. You ate the two servings of the hot dish. Oh, did he? Rue? He did. Yes. So you're like, he did. full metal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sleep on the toilet. <laughs> just... I walk over to Rue. Rue, I want you to know. That I will protect you. So, so regardless of what you say, Rue, you get in your little safe area, and you're like, I'm gonna find him. I'm gonna kill him. Gonna... <laughs> Just fucking rack out in the fucking toilet, my guy. I know Rue's asleep. I, I'm saying this to to the passed out Rue. I will. <laughs> See, you're talking to Rue, and his ears are. Yeah, I'd be like, Rue, I'm up. going. I'm going to protect you. Nightmare, nightmare. Um, well, next time, next time Bishop hits you with a lightning bolt, I'm just not gonna do anything. I don't actually <laughs> say the nightmare. I don't actually say the nightmare bit, but I want to. I'm making piss. He thinks it. He thinks it. Hollow does think about nightmare, but he's he is saying he's going to protect you, and he means that. And he <laughs> he posts up next to Rue with the the fucking um the the Glock or what the. I don't want to call it a Glock, the fucking large frame revolver. Oh. Just kind of tapping against his, uh, tapping against his, uh, his, not his knee, because he'll make me shoot my knee. The side of his, uh, <laughs> I know I, you are. I <laughs> would never roll for that immediately <laughs> right now. This is so funny. No. <laughs> oh, oh, no, go ahead. It's fine. Just tap it, like, <laughs> just tap it. And I got, like, like, like my, the, the all pike in, in the other hand. Long as opposed to like the fucking pole, <laughs> like it really fit in the barrel. Bro, 
No, I, not in the back. Well, I'm, I'm sitting. Oh, I stood outside then. <laughs> outside the door. You're just standing <laughs> You're just standing with an all pike in a little bitty truck. Just staring at fucking brew. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll watch over you. <laughs> you <laughs> lean backwards or some shit? <laughs> Can we go? What? Hold on. No, hold on. Stop. Hold on. How about you're doing that? Speak. What the fuck are you doing? Asleep as fuck. So, how, can we go? What are you fucking doing? <laughs> I make Wait. it up to my little tree hammock. I rack the fuck out. It's next fucking morning. All right, <laughs> let's just go. From just there. see what that oh. moon then. <laughs> so Rue, okay. for Rue, you go. Ah, oh, oh, and you can wake up. You see, you see Hamel with, with red eyes, just staring at you in the <laughs> fucking truck. Good morning. <laughs> Kept you safe. I Thank want to you. go to bed now. <laughs> go to bed, Hummel. You know how I had rocks in my pockets earlier? Yeah. As soon as Kumiko wakes up, she's going to take some of those little pebbles and start chucking them or like flicking them off of her little net at Rue. <laughs> she's annoyed with them. Pink. Boom. Boom. Flicking them where? In the head. Right. I'm, up in, I'm up in like a tree or a couple trees and I'm, I got a little nest there. <laughs> Are you, I, I lost connection as soon as you said what you're doing. <laughs> you're, you're fine. Okay. <laughs> Every, everyone's awake except for Holland's going back to sleep. You guys. I'm looking to the bed. <laughs> you guys re <laughs> refill your truck. <laughs> this is I'm painful. Take one more lap I can't find that fucking wolf knife in the hand. <laughs> towel by my fucking side. <laughs> a towel or foul? Foul. The gun. Owl by my side. Weird threat, but all right, I'm into it. Poor <laughs> more. You can't be fighting wolves, leader. This is not a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Taking one more quick lap. He's not no! hunting a rabbit. You, while you do find plenty of rabbits, you don't find any wolves. <laughs> <laughs> It's a dominance thing now. You know what? I want to roll. Yeah, it for... is. It fucking is. I'm going to roll for Rooties if he shows up. It's looking a boon. <laughs> no. <laughs> Just a dead fucking one. I cannot win today. I cannot fucking win today. <laughs> Jesus God damn Jesus. it, Roo. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> so it, an hour passes of you hate stalking around the fucking forest. You don't find it. Sugi, Sugi says, move that fucking truck. Jesus Christ. Just get, get, get your fucking party moving. Uh, can, I, can I get like a pack of Newports or something from the yeah, cabinet? Yes. You, 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 you get a pack of Newports and a fucking Red Bull. Off you go. Hell yeah. I don't know what I did, man. I don't know what I fucking did. <laughs> Roll for pants. Thank <laughs> you, Franners. <laughs> All right. Uh, how much How much fuel did the Harpies get us? <laughs> they got you. Two two full tanks worth. Okay, cool. Uh, how long does it take us to get to the next encampment? It's four grids. Uh, how fast That's you go? Hours. Uh, well, it's mountainous terrain, so probably just normal speed. I'll say leave in the morning, arrive oh. nine p.m. All right, because it is rough. Uh, as we're driving, Rue would ask to bum one of those new ports off of you, Sugi. Can I have a simulate, please? Man, <laughs> do you want the hookah instead? It's like shit. The hookah broke. Work. The hookah broke. Oh, I remember. <laughs> He's just looking dead ahead. <laughs> okay, we're well, we're parked. I'm gonna go check if there's another one. Cody, <laughs> Cody, please don't, don't, don't mule that into existence. <laughs> That's the last thing I want to RP with fucking Rue. <laughs> Oh god. Oh my god. I don't, I don't it... think I have the strength, Cody. I gotta reload this fucking page. Oh my god. Is there any, uh, is there any cushion in the Do what? Is there any cushion in the cabinet? Hold on. Test scroll something. Hold on. I, I, gotta, I gotta wait till I reload the Yeah, roll. I need to refresh this fucking page. Yeah, I need to refresh this page too. It's, I gotta refresh it's gotta my brain. It's gonna be like brain. a fucking server error or something. I don't know. <laughs> it just depends. Okay, I'm gonna roll. No, it is bereft of Kush. What's in there? And yes, Sonny, I got new pants. I had a spare pair. There is a pack of, <laughs> of early brand Doritos nacho cheese chips. Hell yeah. <laughs> Snagging that. 
<laughs> fuck hell yeah, bro. I'm fucking grabbing those. <laughs> Sumi's been living good. He's been eating human snacks, drinking human liquor for like the past like four weeks. Ever since he got this thing. Right now, it's been like a week. <laughs> Archivist, thank you for letting chat know he has an overst. <laughs> Hummel, if you have to, okay. Is is Hummel still in the turret? I mean, we we've decided to make oh. camp. I assume, right? We've been on the road for like twelve hours. <laughs> Hold on, Hummel. Just, just Hold on. This. You you're driving straight to the fucking camp, right? Yeah. Okay, so you arrive at the camp. Montage. It's, it's not. It's. <laughs> do not say montage at me. Wait, the next camp? I'm gonna say, you guys. You know, I'm just. I want to get out of this fucking mountain range for chat. This is the fucking mule pushing up. I want to get as far <laughs> away from this place as possible. Uh, montage. <laughs> dun, 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 the entire, drive. the entire ride you see, Ruse just got his eye on the tree line looking for wolves. He's <laughs> <laughs> looking up for goddamn dandelions. <laughs> <laughs> smoking a smoking a Newport and looking out the window at the smoke, angrily smoking lap. a Marlboro Red. Just mm, my dad. Uh, we have thirty <laughs> units of fuel left. Uh, the camp is more than willing to refuel all of your fuel cans, and Moonin is more than willing to drive through the night to get you all the Louise. If you will let me yeah. do that. <laughs> Yes, because so I, I, sure. I, I yeah, want to get the fuck out of this forest before I get we, any more we, dumb shit. We, we are chain smoking <laughs> Newports, drinking Red Bull, and eating Doritos. So we are trucking our way over to Lewis. <laughs> so Moonin most chivalrously drives you guys through the night to Louise. You guys arrive <laughs> about eight in the morning, and you guys are finally back. Civilization after what almost two weeks out in the fucking wilds, yeah, mm -hmm. something like that. Guys, that could have been a lot worse. We were supposed <laughs> to be out there for like a month, weren't we? Yeah, something like that. Five weeks, yes. Like, like, yeah, we were only out there two weeks. It's pretty nice. Well, I mean, our shit got blew up halfway through. Now, the it Dodge Adventure is running rough, but don't worry, the A team is going to take care of that. So you guys pull into yes. Louise. Louise is a small little town that's bustling due to the fact that it's re the reverse path for a supply route. So there's a big fucking barracks here, lots of shops, lots of bins. Now, do you guys want to sleep for free in the barracks or one or in one of the, the, the high-end inns? I'm collecting my pay, and I'm hitting the town. I'm collecting my pay, too. Sugi's been craving civilization this has been a crazy ass camp trip so you guys want to go towards command or or a command structure first yes okay yes stand by <laughs> yeah we would want to collect his pay as well buy a case of ammunition for this grand and go practice shooting yeah because we have like <laughs> wolf shaped targets we, we have like what yep. 14 days of uh specialist primary pay which is like five for me it's like what six? So there is a command HQ building, and you guys kind of kind Bad of walk enough. in, and there are troops walking back and forth, auxiliaries. You guys look rough, like you guys look like woof rough. Rue looks <laughs> more rough than the rest of you, but that's because he's a bit manic, pissed. right? Yes, he's pissed off. Mm -hmm. So uh, a specialist goes, uh, "What brings you guys in today?" Big big front desk here. Okay, uh, what Money. unit are you with? The Chakron. Oh, you're the, oh, you, you guys blunted that entire <laughs> spear attack, didn't you? Yes, yep. we did. Oh, well, actually, yep. uh, <laughs> uh, hold on. You guys blunted that entire thing, didn't you? Pads to us, looking rough as shit. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, yes, we, we did. did. <laughs> Fucking moon is so covered, like, like half covered in blood. <laughs> in the background. We have watched him <laughs> five times already. He's still red. <laughs> <laughs> He's still red. He's like the Kool-Aid man now. So he goes, he goes Ashley, uh, y'all want to see Staff Sergeant Primary Pillin? Do we have to? Or... Can we just get their money? I can, and, like... I can go talk to him if you guys just... want me to. Oh, I can come um, with. 
Why is the no got a cowlick on his ass? <laughs> let's let's just go. Let's just go talk. I would have cleaned that up. <laughs> so who's oh, going to talk to oh, Sasser and Primary Pillin? Uh, yeah. come, come, come with us. I'm coming. So you're, so you're all going in? Yeah. yeah. Seems like it. Yeah. So you guys are led down the hallway by this specialist. And she opens the door for you guys. Y'all walk in, and there's a valley elf, uh, younger, you know. He's a staff sergeant primary. And he goes, ah, good, you all look like shit. <laughs> just, just right at you. Feel like it. Smell like mm -hmm. it. Yeah. Probably well, tastes like it. What? 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 Got my pants stolen. Your pants? By who? By a wolf. I found the god. There's a long, long pause. He goes, anyway, there's a reward waiting for you. Cool. Yay. Uh, okay. Cool. I want to sleep in an actual bed. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Uh, you guys want it in Gilders, Shanks, or Clips? Gilders. Gilders are nice. smallest to carry. It's just like... Gilders. <laughs> he all like, 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 okay. He kind of pulls out these five separate little, ba little bags. And he goes... Um, here you go. You kind of hold, kind of hold them out. Teach one of you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah. Thank you very much. Um. Do you do you guys want your new orders first or? No. Can we get those? I think tomorrow? we were told to go back to Stormhorn, but yeah, we well, can, we should come back and get I, them tomorrow. I received, you know, Radiohead in case you guys showed up here first. They wouldn't. They weren't sure if you're show up here or or Jikum or they weren't sure if you're going backwards, but mm -hmm. like uh. I think I guess you know you have about three weeks of off time lined up for you. You just gotta go to Stormhorn, oh, report oh in, my. and you get uh, three weeks paid leave because you guys helped out. Oh, hell yeah. Hey, sounds good to me. It's the best news all day. Now hey. there, now hold on, hold on there, fellas. There's an incentive because of your apparent expertise. They're willing to pay you 100 guilders a piece for a special extra mission if you're up for it. Can we get that after the three weeks? No. Fuck. Let's Can we at least hear them out before accepting? Is it that secretive that we can't hear about it unless we accept? No, no, no. More or less, they're going to they want to put you out on seek and destroy. Uh, roughly two months in the field. A <laughs> hundred for two months. Seek and destroy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you, we'll give you ammunition, food, water, and we, their command will just send you out and cause havoc. There's a lot of orcs okay. up north, but okay. uh, it's four months field work with no contact. You guys figure out your own supplies. Where's the spider going? Kind of points towards Kamuko. Uh, <laughs> Just... <laughs> Shit, sorry. Just, just like no, <laughs> back down the door. <laughs> but that is her reaction. She's just like pleading with the others, like giving big spider eyes. Like, like ag not <laughs> again. It's just voluntary. They're really impressed. You know. Big promotions lined up. If y'all come back and survive, up to you. So, Did we do the mission up before? So you're saying I can have three weeks paid leave, which mm -hmm. is 21 days, mm -hmm. and I make nine. No, 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 no. Remember, a week is a week is eight eight, eight, days. eight days, and I make nine a day, correct? Nine a week, I believe. Nine a week. So you're offering me barely more than my current salary. Well, no, because you guys will get, you know, better weapons, advanced armor, a new vehicle, um, access to fire support from both Cheyennes and the Super Tweets. Um, bonus pay for orc command satchels. They're giving you, they're allowing you to take 35 gold per command satchel you find. Um, again, if you guys take the job, it's an instant promotion or two. That way it looks better on books, cool. you know. <laughs> that, that definitely does sweeten the pot. That's so nice. you're saying we can hang out and have a vacation or be bad in it. Well, right. there is a pretty high death rate so far, but you guys have been the ones who survived the longest, so, you know. There is 61 
dog tags in my van. Which is why <laughs> they're they're offering you this pay to go do this mission, yeah. Can is this something this? that we could think about overnight? No. He's has a, to be right he's now just or not. Like, yeah, it's it's a now or never, because if you guys don't take it, it goes someone else. He kind of looks from guys. looks Aru and Sugi and Pommel and Kumiko and Moon and goes, there's no wrong answer here. It's just what you guys want to do. I'm Pommel in. gets a promotion to everyone, what everyone else is. Do I get three promotions? Or do oh, I get no, these no, standard... no. You, we know all about you. <laughs> he kind of like nods towards Pommel. You'll get your your two, but you'll be, you be way under as per usual. Hey, hey. Don't. Can we get, he needs a grenade bullshit. I need the grenade launcher. He needs a grenade launcher. Stormhorn if my 50 might give jams, you My 50 jams, and there's another 50 orcs coming at us, I can't summon enough fire to take them all out. Is don't, I mean, don't get me wrong. I understand that, but you'll get one of Stormhorn, because if you take this mission, you go straight to Stormhorn, and you're on road immediately with full upgrades. But you'll be out so, in the field I'll, for two months, no breaks, no relief. Go out. Come back. I say we have one good night of drinking. We hit Stormhorn. We, we live for Stormhorn tomorrow. We get our asses back out there. Make more money. Mm, yeah, not. Uh, I, don't think, I don't think you, you quite understood me. Um, it's, it's, like a, it's like a right now. No, it's like I put your van on a dragon wagon and they drag your asses back to Stormhorn. You get refitted and you go out. Because... You pissed off a lot of orcs, and they want you bad. And if you go north and get seen slaughtering more orcs, they're going to drag all those orcs north. I'm just going to put in my two cents. I say we take the three weeks. What do we do after Can we go, please, weeks? God, I want a spa day. Get me out of here. Please. <laughs> I want time to train. I want to live. <laughs> Training montage. I want to live. We can train while we make camp. We're not going to be fighting every day. Oh, no, you, you, you're probably you fighting every day. say that. Like, I can guarantee oh. you, you'd be fighting every day. No. Saying that in character. <laughs> to what in character? Were you saying that as the yeah, officer? Like, 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 yeah, as fucking Pillin. He goes, no, you'd be fighting every day. Guaranteed. I guarantee we're gonna be fighting every day anyway. After this, probably. Let's I guarantee just take three weeks. If, if, if you guys go out and come back, you'll be coming back as staff sergeants. That's all I'm saying. I won't be. Well, not you, no, because you, you're a very bad boy. Private. I'm not Hummel. a bad boy. You are a very bad boy. I've read all about you. Everyone knows about you by now. <laughs> it's an accident. Was it though? Yes. You know they found. I didn't mean to use that. You the know they found bone shards in the forest, right? It was. I don't know how those got there. Number one, except for maybe the explosion. Number two, it was a legitimate accident. I did not mean to use an entire brick. You just happened to, you know, mischeck a brick. I happened to panic in the moments because you, my you know they come up, were going you, down. You know they call it the Hummel vibe check, right? <laughs> Hummel vibe check. <laughs> it's happened twice. Uh, it's happened twice. Who else has blown up a satyr? So, not a satyr, but we had a Yamant to detonate an entire Abrams with a with a Hummel vibe check. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I did not mean to use an entire brick. That That is like on, on the way. I'm pretty sure you did. Use... Everyone's pretty sure you did. I... Command thinks you did. I, it was when he was chasing that cart down, and in that moment, it was it seemed pretty heated. I don't really blame him. For well, in mistake. this moment, I need an answer because your yeah. lovely friend here says she wants her break. You look like you're starving for promotion. You put points of humble. You look like you're starving for promotion. You look like yeah. you've had a very rough time. He says towards Rue, and you have you, have, have, have you been wearing a mask? Mm -hmm. You have like a you're you're not as red around your face as the rest of you. <laughs> the mask he wears for his King mm -hmm. of the Ring. All right, so looking at the party, we'll go. All right, so personally, I'm a little more in favor of taking the three weeks. Just doing it back to back to back to back doesn't seem like a good idea for any of us. 
I know Sugi, you're interested in that, and I know Hummel, you're interested. I'm not it, interested it, anymore. At this point, we're 50-50. <laughs> okay, no, so... I don't want to do it anymore. 25-25. So, Sugi, Sugi, what are you thinking, buddy? I'm thinking, what's three weeks going to do? We're going to sit three around... Three weeks allows us rest and training. Training at what? And it also allows us to resupply on our own, to make our own decisions regarding upgrades. Odds are, we won't get to decide what they give us. And to rest, which seems much needed. Yeah, I might accidentally blow up another satyr. Alright. Because so, he's so stressed. Hummel just exactly. This, this sucker just bursts a hummel like this, just burst stares at him. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're gonna, like, what, read some books? Hang out? Hang Fucking out nerd, read your, read your books. I wanna Hang vote that. I wanna, I, vote, I, wanna, I wanna vote that Moon in votes for three weeks off as well. Mm -hmm. Especially considering the gif he sent in chat. <laughs> so, regardless, I'm entirely outnumbered here. I'm not gonna. I I'm I'm not gonna drag you guys into a fight. I'm not gonna go fight by myself. Let's get to let's get to cracking some some books, I guess. I think I can set explosions off with my mind. You I cannot. Does the Paramore get a vote? Yes, I can. So, 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 you, so you look at your shoulder and Paramore goes, I wouldn't mind going to a bathhouse. It seemed kind of cool. Alright. I, I like books. Because, like, you know, you and I can right, hang... In that case, um, so, you can hear, but the, the, as Paramore goes, we could hang out in bed, read a book or two, long walks... Oh. You know, I'll, I'll let you pick a book and I'll read it to you. You better. <laughs> Turn back to the staff surgeon. Real go. Well, it sounds like uh, the group has spoken. Uh, sorry, thanks, but no thanks. It seems we won't be taking that job from you. All we right. Would like some time off. Not a problem. You guys go ahead and rest here for a day or two. I reckon because they want you to stormhorn. They want to talk to you. Debrief. And then give you guys your your fucking path paperwork. Um, more or less, you can go north or south. Depends on where you, where you want to go. You can go all the way down south, but it may take a long time to get there. <laughs> so uh, I know most people here, they usually go to like, eh, like most of them go to First Lake. First Lake's pretty big. And that takes about, depends on if you, give, if you, if you, if you catch some sequential rides from supply trucks, it should take about four or five days to get there four more days in the truck yeah it sucks trust me well i mean do we get, <laughs> got our can, we wagon. get can we get like a, a like a, a a dodge vehicle to back us up it's really tight in that van yeah no you no no yeah i figured if would you, we have gotten a new see, vehicle if we took the job? If you're, you, you would have gotten a brand new vehicle. Actually, they're making them brand new now. Uh, probably one of those updated half tracks or updated Puma. But uh, regardless, um, if you're lucky, they might have that that uh, what do they call it? The transportation circle up around a Stormhorn. There've been a lot of issues with supplies, and they're trying to really shortcut. Apparently, Yule is working on some kind of steam engine with the Serbians. It's it's hard hard to really figure out how all that works. But there, if you guys are lucky, there might be that circle up running at Stormhorn. If it is up and running, they probably port you off to like I don't know, Fath Dorai or fucking Emil Norris if you're lucky. Just pew. of course, there's been a slight problem. The tests have been five out of six land where it's supposed to, but the one kind of, yeah, kind of, you know, disappears entirely. You know, they, they find them eventually. We end up in the Emily Bronze like <laughs> books. <laughs> okay, guys. Hey, yo, what the Shit, fuck? I wrote, a, I wrote a one. <laughs> You're on Earth now. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> What's that redhead doing with with that with that changeling? <laughs> <laughs> so, how much did the staff surgeon give us in uh, in extra pay? So, you guys each have thirty guilders in each bag. Ooh, each okay. of you. In, uh, in extra pay or in total pay? Total. And then okay. we got what sixteen days? You said we were two weeks. He's rolling dice. 
Oh, that might have been me by accident. I was trying to turn off my toggles. <laughs> he rolled like <laughs> four times. So you Sorry. guys have 12 GP, 40 SP, 126 CP from your loot. Then you have the 30 GP, including your pay and your bonus per person. Put Scratching out the 100 GP per person guild, so this job is reneged. <laughs> Chances of it coming back to you are high. If there is a... If something goes wrong, I might give it back to you. We'll find out. Something's mm -hmm. gonna go wrong. <laughs> you know, oh, no, if, no, if, it wrong. Give, if they give me a couple days of rest, I, I feel like... A couple days of rest, the gang might be more willing to to go tear it up. Yeah, it, if we just get like a couple days to chill and breathe, I just want a single think... shopping day, please. <laughs> yes. <laughs> right. Um. So, what was the split on the? Uh, well, the loot was like what twelve guilders. So the total, not split, the total is twelve forty one two six. Here, I'll put it right here for you. Twelve All GP. Right. Uh, 40, if we definitely. drive to Stormhorn, can we just skip the the days and just arrive there? Do we have to? It'd be asked really nicely. Yeah, I mean, I don't I really have enough buildings to where I buy anything. We don't get paid much. So that's your current loot bundle right there, which you can convert upwards if you find something to make change for you. What is Sugi in the combat? Oh, that's what he's fighting so the bear. He's fighting the demons right now. Oh, right. Hey, demons. No, that's Rue right now. Fighting that that, yeah. that inner demon. Okay. Uh, <laughs> find that fucking wolf. There's five of us. There was 12 guilders. I'm just going to take two of them so I can have 140 guilders. Mm. And then y'all can split the rest. You take two guilders? <laughs> Put some and of the party funds too. We we gotta go sell our uh, sell our uh, twelve M16s. Yep. yep. So yep. the sergeant goes, "Oh, you guys brought back equipment." Hmm? Yeah, we looted it off the orc corpses. Well, if you guys take that to command a stormhorn, they'll give you they'll, get, they'll give you a bigger bonus. Are they human made or? Uh, not sure. Uh, Probably not. Probably we were a little tired. We didn't really have a lot of time to check. Do you want to check for us? No, I don't want... No, I'm good. All right. We All spend right. one night here, and then we'll head to Cop Stormhorn. Holy shit, that's a lot of money in our in the fucking adventure right now. <laughs> these, 300, these are 300 guilders each. Yeah. God, God's gonna roll for it, you know that. Because condition and... And how well the orcs took care of each one. Uh, I would I never. <laughs> human made. And also, I, we can just clean the weapons. I have a fucking alchemy kit. Mm -hmm. like, every ounce of rust can be stripped off those. We can do that over the five days we're going to. Uh, we can just yeah. clean the weapons. Hummel yeah. will help. Just yeah, okay, yeah, okay. That's not the word. Let's go. Bloop, 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 bloop. Well, yep. we get if we could hand wave the five days away instead of leaving chat an opportunity to <laughs> add more. I shenanigans. don't know. Chat does kind of like fucking yet, Rue. <laughs> okay, so it's not a female wolves. <laughs> I guess chat's lapping up the fucking attention. Bark, 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 bark. So we'll oh, end. <laughs> Rue's white whale. Yeah, this is my white whale. Rue's I am white Ahab. Whale. <laughs> oh gosh. I'm A to the fucking happiness, bitch. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and rule. I'm just white whale. Go on, sorry. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna go ahead and rule that you guys travel to Stormhorn. Mm -hmm. Do it. Do it, you yeah. fucking. I don't think you have a selected. Maybe? I do. Do it. You. Okay, never mind. Off you go. So you guys travel Stormhorn, and we'll end our game for tonight there. You guys are having a Stormhorn. You guys will finally have non-combat shooty bangy mission time, and you guys can oh. plan ahead for that. Okay. Uh, oh, 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 wait, so we end. One, hold on, hold on. I, I, I have one request. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. Rue. As yeah. you guys are passing through fucking Nijim, you're kind of driving along. You know, it's been in this truck for a while. Y'all getting plenty of fuel. You look at the window on a far off hill. You see a fucking. It looks like a, da- a, 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 a fucking dandwall on the hill kind of staring at you. How far away are we talking? About, okay. about 400 yards. 400 yards? Let me double check something real quick. <laughs> so, uh, let me see here. And it kind of walks yards. away. 400. No, 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 no. <laughs> I, I just had to double check the range on them. That's max range. I'm taking a shot off at that fucking dandwall. <laughs> it's a you yard's see it? defeat. <laughs> are you just like telling me to pull over? No, he's firing from the fucking passenger, passenger side as we're Wait, driving. Is he on the right side or the left side of the road? So this is going to be a extreme range shot. So you're going to do it. So so you're going to roll your roll your shot with range maximum. Range at maximum. Uh, now the real there question is, what's a DR going to be in the open at far range? I'm going to say it's going to be DR twenty five. Mm, okay. We'll you know, you fuck up the shot. Oh, oh my oh, fucking god. god. I just did. Just fucking I redeemed s- myself. Just slaps that dog. Roll, roll, fucking roll damage. Dude. I redeemed myself. You've rolled point yeah. all night, and finally. Does not. So, do. so you wing it, but you don't kill it. It goes, Burr! it kind of like rolls on the fucking hill. <laughs> what? Almost singing White Whale. Just you see. Sugi, as you're driving, just a smile will creep across Rue's face as he pulls the Grand back in. Settles what? down, takes another hit off the Newport. <laughs> you had to roll in that point. Nice had long to... drag. God damn it, dude. Uh, well, there you go, Cody. You you did that. <laughs> he said one more roll for the wolf to tauntingly show up. You fucking wing that bitch off a goddamn car door. <laughs> Oh, uh, jeez. All right. Literally, this is Rue. The full scene, he, like, takes a drag off the cigarette, and then just... <laughs> yep. All right. Uh, <laughs> chat, 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 we will... I just see this gif in the fucking... Uh... <laughs> just... What's the Carcano? Oh, is that the fucking is? <laughs> All right. So, chat, we will see you next Tuesday for Chalk Dust. Players, say goodnight. Good night. Good night, chat. <laughs> Rue got molested. Ha ha. Ha ha.